there is somebody in my industry that I will never forgive. Nobu Igwe. I am mentioning it publicly. I will beat Nobu Igwe to the extent I have an issue with Tunde Adnan. Tunde Adnan was somebody at one time who felt basketball bullied him at the hotel. You felt bullying that day. I saw the way you cry. Ah, Baba, this one. But today, I never said vote for Tinumbu. Hmm. Your episode with T Baba T, mm. I said Sheila stole his joke. Yeah, this yeah, one yeah, yeah. And then people they say Sheila T Baba T joke. This one. The time that we started when I knew Baba T, Ay was not even in the picture. Mm. Ay has not even started doing open mic. Every now and then, I screenshot stuff on social media and I send it to Sheila Tinumbu, who is probably the person that I'm closest to. Ah, Baba. No, this decision. So, no buigwe, if you they watch, know that I am sitting and waiting patiently for you in hell. Welcome to the Honest Bunch Podcast. Mm. We are number one. We are the best. <laughs> There's no argument. Her. But the fact that I say that we are number one and we are the best, not be just because of what we they do. Now, most importantly, because of God. And then the support when we say when they give us. So every time we curate great content, it is done with the intention to serve you better. We're grateful for your comments. All the times, when sometimes we go go up, come down, I go tell us, say no, behave well. We have, we appreciate it. We're grateful. Thank you so much. Then make I bring good news. Ozioma, as I they always, they bring them every week. First, workman, workman. If artists are never show you pepe, you know go no say it gets some people when go confuse you to the point where they say you go you go give up on life. You go all day, you go look your fridge. Eh? After somebody don't come repair your fridge fifteen times in two weeks. As in they go, the fridge goes spoiled. Isn't they never tell you what thing be happen to them? You go begin to put your shoe inside your fridge. That's what my you will condemn the fridge, isn't it? I have a testimony. Hey, what happened? Talk <laughs> to us. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it all started last week. Okay. Right on, sister. I have not found the right one to do mm, my permanent to, cleaning. To clean your cabinet. Hallelujah. As I came into the house, you know, from the last time they cleaned, oh, it was nice, neat. Mm, and the guy that cleaned it, you know. Who tell you that guy walk my No, they are clear your cabinet now. Continue. Hey. So, I saw cockroach. Hey. You know, say, man, they fear. Woman. You know, say, eh? Man, they fear woman. Woman, woman, woman they fear cockroach. Yes, oh, yes, I saw ma'am. cockroach. I jumped. Hey. I hung onto my bed. And I quickly brought out my phone. And I went to Walkman. Send me a cleaner immediately! <laughs> they now sent you him. I said, okay. I said, oh, oh, I was going to go up and build the sun. I mentioned it was a male cleaner. Anyway, so you are right. No, I know what they're talking about. What are you doing? I hung on to the bed until he finished cleaning. Cleaning! Oh! Since you are looking for Jesus. Praise Anyway, short, long and short of the story is that workman came through as always. Hallelujah. For my nails, my house. Ah, I'm a, That's my nice workman. Let me see. In case you need massage, <laughs> Nuru massage precisely. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> there. No, no. No, no, no. I don't sabi la. Interesting, interesting. I'm the worst when it comes to laughing. So all this, all this thing called be like innuendos to things that we are not planned. Interesting. So guys, we don't even talk too much. We don't talk about Walkman. You also know now, a free prize mm-hmm. by original of the highest grade, mm-hmm. premium quality, and also for France. win prizes. <laughs> so that you don't know, go, go, you know, go travel. You go don't tell people say you they travel. You go reach airport. You pass. You know that they are scanner. Go Madam, go, bing, 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 please bing, move aside. <laughs> say, move aside. This they bag is you. They don't see anything. <laughs> they can't carry your bag. Counts when you don't already make up for that. Just say, it's, it's, croco- <laughs> it's crocodile skin. <laughs> they can't see that for more. <laughs> You are in serious trouble. <laughs> serious method for us. Yes, sir. <laughs> Design a crocodile. <laughs> so, Afri Price. Go there. Buy the tattoos and you go also win prizes. Win prizes then yeah. that boy, we would always sing in praises. 
That boy would don't know anything. You want me the jig? You want me the jig? Grab me coffee. Yes. You, you see, you don't, no, need, so no need to talk too much. <laughs> Adult nation entertainment. Will they see the work that you do? More to continue. So no need for elaborate introduction because yeah. I don't see everybody face. Dirty cold, beautiful, delectable. Zini Porsche, Zini Nema, Majelov, <laughs> Nedu, Azobia, myself, husband, material. Then our guest, when we say from beginning, end up put Martin inside. <laughs> this man, I guess you when we say, you know fit, you know fit. See, eh, even the choices of words, we fail to qualify Super. his personality. Super. Mm. Yes. His story is an embodiment of grace. You understand? So people went try him. The G come out, C enter, then Chris. I'm going so well. See, uh, when you look at him today, and for those when we say maybe don't read about him or when don't hear when he talking story, you go they find him hard to use balance how that boy when we say from when he young, he don't traverse the length and breadth of Nigeria, saying they go school. Then he can't sell fish. He do so many things, but he don't reach the point today where we say when for the industry, if he talk now authority, just give a microphone. You go no say this talent not be waiting that they buy or then they learn. You know if you do apprentice for this one, he good now follow come. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking of no other than the man who is the most talked about. Yes, he's the most talked about Nigerian. He's standing on something and he's not going to remove his leg. <laughs> he's the press out the go. Make some matcha, noise. Matcha, 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 Reza. Reza, Reza. Super talented <laughs> comedian, actor, motivational speaker. He's a teacher, the one and the only Lawrence Oluwa Sheito, Aleti Leke Sheito. Baba, now you now. Oh if not, you say you old, trust me. Eh? <laughs> Now you for introduce me what they do my area. Jesus, I'm going to say maybe you want me to be next of king. <laughs> but thank you very much, Baba. We appreciate it. Oh, it's so good to be with it's you guys. It's also good well. to point out that, you know, I don't call him name. When I don't hear Oluwa Sheiton, you know, I don't say na Yoruba, but he's married to a beautiful woman from the southeast of Nigeria. Yeah, so if you, define, if you define Nigeria when they detribalized, when all they look say, this one come from, this one come from, yeah. <laughs> Naimo and his wife, fine. Yeah. Ah, what, what, what do you expect? Hey. What do you expect? Ew. Ew. <laughs> See the way you don't make for this sweet <laughs> thing. If you say, say, say you want to kill me now, you ought to say daddy Tiwa. Ew. Daddy Tiwa. Daddy Tiwa. Oh, no, do like Tiwa. this now. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, for Sheila wedding, I was at Sheila's wedding. My brother, if you need to see Sheila, Sheila be like, they carry do adverts. <laughs> all those, all those AIDS adverts. This child is from Uganda. <laughs> fly, fly, go where, where fly, fly go there inside the eye. <laughs> all those children, they only don't know where they got them. Fly go there inside the picky eye like this. You go, I can't enter the eye. And the picky don't go blink. All those people so go up with touch them. Ah, Maybe but, not tell this if they use uh, Chroma, be all this brother, thing for us, we don't know. VFX. But uh, the, the truth is, Shailo, even as he be like that, he was hot. Yes, now. He wear great, not great suits you wear for that wedding. Why you want to call feel like, say, you really did? Yeah. Come on, shut up. <laughs> What's wrong with oh, you? Yeah, oh, yeah, Do you know what it means to cross, to cross the land of the West? Yes, and go and to the land of the West. Fly over South-South mm. and then get into Southeast. Mm. And you did not stop at the boundary of furniture. Mm. You move straight beyond Uman here mm. to go to Isi Alangwa mm. and pick a beautiful woman. Mm. Oh and you brought her to the West. Mm. And you pamper her, embellish her, mm. and then set her abroad to go and do course. Mm. Do you think it is easy? It's not. She's not even an Abia Babu. Yes. Abia yes. Babu. Hey. Isi Alangwa, not precisely. Yes, yes, yes. Not South. Reza, Reza. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, okay. We oh are yeah, nice one. Uh, make we enter into serious matter now. And what we want to talk about today, now topic where they very very important. We're discussing bullying, and we're also going to talk about bullying in children. You understand? Mm. We we'll go discuss this matter. We'll talk about cyber bullying also, cyber stalking. We we'll also talk about depression. We'll talk about anger and self restraint. Now, there's an example that I am very sure that many people who are active on the social media space um, can remember from the top of their head. After the AFCON finals where Nigeria lost 2-1 to the elephants of Cote d'Ivoire, the Super Eagles of Nigeria, 
you know, um, one of the players, Alex Iwobi, was hmm. targeted for abuse. Now, people, they frustrated. Hmm. The pain people, especially as the Eagles, then they progress. People, the team called the sweet people. I remember the game against South Africa. The roads were empty. People yes, yes. went to various viewing centers to see that game. And you could see the joy. The sale of um, Super Eagles jerseys went up. The team finished for market. Everyone was, you know, anticipating that final and expecting that Nigeria would win. But in finals, you win some, you lose some. Mm. But for that in own particular matter, it can't be like, say, some people carry, some people just target in lifestyle. There was a popular video that went online. Somebody did like a screen recording of his social media um, page on Instagram. I was going on and on about him being a footballer. He doesn't post videos of himself training. Now, wearing wear fine clothes, when they do modeling and the rest of them, it took a toll on him because, I mean, he had to leave the social media space for a while. We have seen solidarity amongst Nigerians, you know, the, his teammates, everybody don't come and come to us say, even though the team pay you because you're passionate, he get the way where we say people suppose they exercise restraint because this is a person where we say they give giving all for a country. That one, that one example. Oh. But we don't see many cases of how people go just go on top of social media to bully other people, especially people when they don't even know. Mm -hmm. They have not had direct contact with them. Maybe because you don't share the opinion the person has expressed or you just feel like you pass the person or you get numbers. You won't use them against that person. So today we'll go discuss them. We'll also discuss the effect. And most importantly, you are going to live with one very good thing. I will leave that until the end of the show. Once again, Sheila, welcome to the Honest Bunch podcast. Mm -hmm. Bye! This is that podcast where they make people they confess with they no plan. <laughs> <laughs> and the one where they sweep, they do pass. Once they mention breast, the way they massage leg, the way they go cross leg. They, they, they talk why? about times that they, they, they do like this. You, you, want, you, you want to come in public? What's wrong with you? My brother, my breast. What was going on? Why, 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 what's going on again? Hey! <laughs> See, they give me all what, shapes and sizes. What is wrong with you? Some of us are born breast men. You know, uh, 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 sorry, let's continue with your discussion. Okay, oh yeah, oh yeah, let's continue. So let's begin, let's begin first with uh, unless person won't lie. You understand? Mm -hmm. You na person will be say, uh, especially, especially at this time, you na person will be say, you don't deal with, mm -hmm. you know, a lot mm -hmm. of uh, cyber, cyber bullying. bullying. You know, even though you show strong uh, face. But there was even one point where the thing even, it wasn't just even about you. Now, say maybe people, things where you consider precious or dear, people, they use them, they attack you. Mm -hmm. I mean, there was the incident with your daughter yeah, Tiwa. and mm -hmm. Tiwa, your beautiful daughter, and how, you know, these things went on and on at some point. I could just like, me, we'll just go back to the very, very beginning and talk about how... A, a, a lot to talk about in that regard. Okay. I'll mm -hmm. tell you the honest truth. Um, as I did, so there is somebody in my industry that I will never forgive. In the entertainment industry. In the entertainment industry. No I will never, I am mentioning it publicly. No I will never forgive him until he apologizes to my wife. Because of during the election, he made a post and he put my wife's name. Hmm. And somebody under the comment called my wife an Usu. Hey, outcast. It means an outcast. So if nobody go the year or they watch this program, may I first start with problem. You understand me? The day our, our path has not crossed since then, the day our price, our path crosses, if nobody mistakenly, if it be the hem of in garment, now I touch my body, I will beat nobody go to the extent that the world will ask what he did wrong. That is where I draw the line. You can offend me in anything, abuse me, press my head, match him. But you see, the moment you cross the line of me to my family, my wife, my children, you understand me? You cross the line into hell. And I will leave heaven for that, to sit with you in hell. So no buigwe, if you they watch or anybody ever sent you this video, know that I am sitting and waiting patiently for you in hell. 
That is number one. <laughs> you see, let's talk about bullying, you know? Uh, I'm a person who grew up in a space where I didn't live with my parents. I lived with an uncle, with his wife, the children. And growing up in such an environment, it doesn't have to be that you are maltreated mm -hmm. or anything. It's just that you grew up in such a circle where you don't have people to talk with. So you grew up practically on your own. You grew up talking to yourself. And that experience taught me something. A man that has not left, that has not learned to live alone, has not yet learned to live. Mm. A man that has not learned, learned to, to live, live alone, alone has not yet learned to live. To live. Mm. He taught me that. And why do I say that? You see, I can leave the entertainment space and I can be in solitary confinement, in solitude or seclusion, and I'll be <clears> fine. <throat> I won't miss anything that is happening in the entertainment space. I've learned to live beyond the noise of the crowd. I don't perform for a stadium where over 10,000 people day. Where I see people, they jump for their seats, they crease for my performance. And at the same time, I don't perform where two people day. And I've enjoyed the company of those two people more than the thousands of people shouting Sheila. Mm. So noise not be waiting they new to me. And it doesn't freak me. So because of that, I have learned to talk to myself, which is one of the reasons why I choose my words. Carefully. Carefully before I use them. You know, a lot of people came around my page to abuse me because of this government, Tinobu's government and mm -hmm. all the stuff. Mm -hmm. But in all of it, go and check all my posts. <clears throat> I never said, vote for Tinumbu. Hmm. Go and check. I write the things that I know he did in Lagos, and I will put Ashwa Jubola Amen Tinubu is my candidate, or is who I am voting for. I didn't tell you to vote for him. I didn't tell you to vote for him. <clears throat> and again, Sheila did not make the 8.9 million people that voted for him. I'm just a number amongst those numbers. Yes, do I have influence over some people? Mm -hmm. Maybe. But would I want to use my influence wrongly? I use my influence for what I believe in. Which is why before we got to this point, I had done some certain things. You understand me? I have been very careful. I have fought for the Nigerian that I believe should be. You understand me? And I believe that this person is the person that I believe will take us to that Nigeria that I want us to be. So if he makes mistake, do you think I will keep quiet and I won't tell him that he's making mistake? You've known me a long time, Edu. I don't usually will come outside to come and just talk on the social media place without having done some work at the background first. Mm -hmm. The people that I'm supposed to talk with, I talk to them. <sighs> Every now and then, I screenshot stuff on social media and I send it to Sheyit Inumbu, who is probably the person that I'm closest to in the government. When I say, Baba, see this one. Baba, I think this person should be the person that is in our NOE, mm -hmm. Nigeria Orientation Agency. Mm -hmm. Ah, Baba... No, this decision, so I think it is best <clears throat> if we subsidize transportation instead of for subsidy. Ah, Baba, I think we should subsidize food production instead of uh, uh, while we float the Naira. You understand? These are the things we will go to do for background. And then when we see that probably these things are not being followed, we are trying, we come out to speak you understand? So that people will also know that we also feel their plight. But we are not dealing with politics. Mm -hmm. We're talking about bullying. Mm -hmm. And this is it. You know, I had to just digress a little bit. The first time people saw me react to bullying was when the issue happened with Kemi Olun Lawyer. And no matter the issues that I have with you, <clears throat> that doesn't mean I won't respect your person. Like I tell people, Kemi is a brilliant person. She's intelligent. But being intelligent doesn't mean that you are not infallible to mistakes. And one of the things that led to that particular aspect of our exchange. situation and exchange 
was the fact that she was in freezing. I wrote something <sighs> actually supporting her. But because the person that took the news to her saw the headline, said she attacked her. And in reaction to that, she started attacking my daughter. First, I'm somebody who loves when we do things, we do it, you know, you know, you detail everything, you weigh every angle before you make judgment. One was that she spoke about my daughter and she said she was obese. You don't just measure obesity by mere looking at the picture. And again, she's a baby who's got baby fat. What are the quantity of food that she eats? And I tell you, <laughs> the money I spent on food for Tiwa, <laughs> If it was the same amount that I spent on the second born, I for they happy because that second one eats past Tiwa. Mm -hmm. Tiwa was not even eating, and that one don't even get Tiwa fat. You understand? Mm. You don't even get Tiwa fat. But that one eats more than Tiwa. So sometimes you don't just measure, uh, measure obesity by mere looking mm -hmm. or begin to talk about the food where mm -hmm. they begin it, where you know they see the quantity of food mm -hmm. where they measure mm -hmm. for her. And part of the reason why Tiwa had that weight as at that time was because she was born at about eight months. Some seven months or some, you understand? And so they had to keep her in an incubator for about another week, which was why the hospital costs, where that they take jokes, they very high, where they, they, yes. well, they always take jokes. So sometimes when people, when you don't have the details, don't judge on the surface. Mm. And we try to tell people, <laughs> it is easy to criticize based on surface, but find your details, you know, get all your facts right, so that when you talk, you talk from a, from a, a of place knowledge. of, inf from an informed place. Yes. Don't be saying you just talk, boah. Then when we begin size up, wait till, wait till you talk. Then we come begin to say, why this person just throw up statistics when not right, like a former presidential candidate. You know, just throw up statistics like that. If you want to throw up statistics, let it come from an informed place so that when you talk, if we fact check you really, we'll talk, say, wait till this person talk. Not true. Not true, he talk. If you have spoken in that regard, I probably wouldn't have had an issue with her. You understand? And then she can't get some minors, uh, minions there where they support her. You understand? So at first, I was trying to take it to her from a place of education. When she mentioned these things, me too, I'll go do my own fact reading and I'll come, have you, did you mention this one before you came to this conclusion? At first they take him easy, but she know, yeah. And then when I saw that I was getting dirty, that was why I said, if you go to the gutters, I will go into the gutters with you. Mm. And me, I know I'll come follow you, sit down for the gutter, I'll go to swim <laughs> <laughs> inside the gutter. As I be swim. I know mm. when to stay clean and I know when to swim like a dirty pig. You understand me? Now, when I got to that stage, when I saw that I was playing it cool, she know the one respond. Mm. I took her back home. As a Yoruba man, I grew up in an environment where proverbs were used a lot. So when I dig into some of those proverbs where our people they use, when I put them into the talk and I post them, she said her mother read it and her mother wept. And it was at that time, now the consciousness done on her. Mm. That uh, be like, say this guy don't. So when she mentioned her, the reaction of her mother, I also have a mother that I love so much. Mm -hmm. At that point, I felt it was okay. okay. And then I reached out to her. I said, go and check the previous post that this person said. I insulted you. I insulted you. At that time, I couldn't send the post. She couldn't read that. Couldn't realize say, ah. This person was not even insulting me, he was actually fighting for me. Because what I wrote in that first post, we caused this problem. I said she was arrested by a pastor, mm. and people were saying the pastor should free her, this one and that. And I was telling people, instead of you saying that the pastor should free her and not just talking like that, have you considered pleading with the pastor? Do you know what her post, the damages that the post have done to the pastor? Instead of just calling the pastor, we should plead with the pastor to be considerate. Mm and forgive, not be saying we just say, hey, the pastor, mm -hmm. you don't damage other people and you want to also be the one to, to tell them how to react. No, you don't do that. It is, it is not the right way to go. The necessary thing is once you make mistake, 
Be humble enough to apologize. You understand? And let forgiveness take its natural course. And, and the and the and the funny thing about that Kimberly Lawyer story, and the funny thing also about bullying on in social media space, you cannot you cannot state it enough. You go see person when if you say go comment under Shay Law post insulting Kemi. And you go see person where you go go Kemi's post commenting and insulting Shay. Mm -hmm. And you where they go there go insult. You know even know the real story. And if somebody go insult, you go see under the insult of that person's insult, you go see people go like that was one time. That was one time something happened. One one company, me Imam my God. Imam my God, you know Imam my God. Mm -hmm. One company paid me and Imam my God some years ago. Uh, uh, to do as if say would they fight, you understand? So he oh my God first insult me for the video. In fact, he insult. I just land London that time. I think I was 2007, 2008. I was just landed London that time. Now I see the message. Now they can't send me waiting me. I go talk on my own. Now I mean I garnish. I mean I said I even send that to you or something. I send that to Chukudi. I mean I said you give me lines or something. Chukudi send me lines where I go take talk away. Now nah, garnish him, drop my own too. My brother, you not gonna believe, say, as Ima drop your own, people enter in my DM, even for comment, then they do very stupid, short man, devil, bastard. You don't say, why well, I don't define how to enter him. Even enter in DM. Guess what? People with me and him know. Mutuals. Mutuals. I can't drop my own reply. Now so people enter my DM. The same people. The same. Oh, wow. Enter my DM. They do, what that man. Let him know that you're a Biafra man. But you shot. And the funny thing is, a man with screenshot sent to me, me with screenshot sent to him. At the end of the day, when they come find out, say, I stunt, all of them. Shame. Shame. <laughs> Do you understand? You see, you see um, we live in a world right now where uh, shame, is no shame is no longer, uh, uh, how do I put it now? Those days, shame was a thing of pride. Somehow, I will explain. Those days, when we want to do some things and we consider th that this thing can bring shame to the family, we will just lose it. Mm -hmm. I beg, I don't want me. I get family. Mm -hmm. You understand? And then, but now, uh, I beg you, you go give me popularity now, then no. The name don't change to clout. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's now clout. Do you understand? Like <laughs> me now, for example, do you not till date as I am? You get what will happen between me and my wife, I no pray me my elder brother here. Mm. Because my family, they no go support me. If they call me, I be man, no. You know my elder brother will come to my house, come visit me. I go there, try <laughs> not to do some kind thing. I'll, I'll, at some point, I'll come to say, I'm at my house now. Mm -hmm. I mean, he come visit me. I ain't going to detect what It's the way... Some of us were brought up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we value respect. We value honor to people. So when I do things, I want to do things that I see that will bring honor to other people, not anything to dishonor other people. Mm -hmm. And that's why when we tell people that if you want to criticize even on social media or you want to talk, try make it constructive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Select your mm. choice of words. It is there is nothing wrong in criticizing somebody mm -hmm. because at some point in our life, whether we like it or not, we will criticize even the closest person to us. Mm. Mm. Situations will arise where we will have to criticize the person, but the way you do it, now go determine what will be the aftermath. Mm -hmm. You understand? Like the Yoruba have an adage. They say if we use right hand, uh, right hand. Beat picking. Beat picking. Mm. Go use one. left hand. Drum close. Say drum close. But you know, if you use both hands, beat the picking. You won't come use the both hand, say drum close. As you raise the both hand to you come go like this, you, you go for say, mm -hmm. you won't use the two mm -hmm. hands to beat them at this time. Mm. So when would they when would they see? And I wear people, they make mistakes. Somebody will tell say, as they talk about Alex Iwobi, I read a comment. The person say, Man, I just they talk there, man, I no tell and the truth because mm -hmm. I made a post. To say, my brother, a few will have negative things to say about you, but many more love you. Mm -hmm. You understand? The person say, "Man, I don't tell him the truth." And I do this. No, how do you say your truth? Mm. You know, on social media, there's a 
any any platform, any social media platform that you're using, there's the option of block button, right? And you can easily like prevent yourself from saying certain things. I know people are mad. Lots of people are mad. They want to frustrate you. They can go and create another account to start attacking. What do you think about the government regulating social media? You see, um, the issue of government regulating social media, I'm not a fan of it. Mm. You understand? And um, as much as I will feel one more will talk about government, eh? you see, government talk, are they too passionate about Nigeria? So if you involve me in government talk, <laughs> your program go long. Mm. It go long where, where. You see, me, personally, I tell anybody, nobody, not APC, not APC government should say they want to regulate social media. If any other person wants to regulate social media, that talk should not come from APC. You know why? They use the same social media against Jonathan. Yes, me, I'm a factual person. During the first subsidy protest in 2012, yeah. I remember we were gathered in Ojota. Mm -hmm. I took a bike from Ikorudu to Ojota. I don't forget that day. This is something, first of the remover was something that affected my show. If you remember, I was the first person that did January 1st. Mm. I did January 1st, 2022. And it was that day that first subsidy was removed by Jonathan. And when protest was going on, it affected my show. So I could be somebody to kick against Jonathan's choice of removing first subsidy. But I wasn't. I remember, if you go on my social media, I'll bring out some things. I remember that day, I went on stage. And I came up after Idris. Now, Idris has gone on stage. And when he was talking, Idris Abdul Karim, he went on stage and he was saying, those people, the way they vote for Jonathan, where they um, campaign for Jonathan, where they're not there yet today, turned off, you know, it's just the talk. I understand his activism. Mm. You understand? But when I came on stage, I said, no, be to come swear for ourselves. <laughs> now, carry us come. We are discussing the impact of what government, the decision of the government. I am not against first subsidy remover. I said it live on stage. I still remember that channels interviewed me and I told them something. I said, what we should be asking ourselves is what would happen after the first subsidy has been removed. The money that will be saved, will they be accountable? Where are they going to channel those the money, money to? You understand me? But APC, APC, this same APC, where I support their candidate, politicize that moment. Hmm. And they did not give Nigerians ample time to think for themselves. And today, they are the ones who are champions of the first subsidiary mobile, which is, by the way, a good thing. But even them even now... Even if the subsidy never come out... Mm, even them now, that they fail to give us the right palliative, we suppose is the burden of the first subsidiary mover hmm. on Nigerians. That they fail in that regard. And I'll tell them the truth as it is. Now, the reason why they say, okay, now APC used that model, take come into government, and now you want to regulate it because people are talking back at you. Mm -hmm. Now you should be able to take what you give. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you cannot take it, don't give it. Is that, the reason, is, is, is that the reason why you think they want to get, get to social media and regulate social media? Th that is it. They, they cannot give me any other justification sure. for why I know. Fake news are bound. Mm -hmm. mm. What 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 is what is what is um X doing now? Former Twitter. What mm -hmm. is it doing now? People will post some stuff and they will write under it mm -hmm. that the this picture notes. has been readers' yes. notes mm. to debunk. I know that some certain things they might not have the full understanding to debunk it. Mm -hmm. That is where government needs to get to work. In the UK, for example, if you go to gov.uk. Every necessary information that you need about government is available on the site. Yeah. Mm. And there are links from that place to every other agencies of government. But in Nigeria, we don't have that. And for me, that is where the National Orientation Agency Obviously. is failing. They need to work with the new Minister of Information who has ample knowledge, um, um, uh, information technology, this uh, Bosun mm -hmm. Tijani. Bosun who has ample knowledge of IT to create a website that passes government information, general information to everybody. So when you put out something that is false, 
it is easy for AI to detect that according to their government, this thing is false. Mm. So if you have not put the necessary mechanism in place to tackle those issues, mm. don't try to say you want to back, regulate back, back the to, voice of the people. Back to, back to bullying. Now, we use social media a lot. In fact, yeah, I, I, I can tell you um, um, this show personally also have been part one of the people who don't get the brunt of social media bullying. Now it's so it's so sad at the fact that a lot of people just like you said, they are not equipped with enough knowledge of why they hate something or why they are attacking something. They just go with it. For example, sometime, you know, that time when they attack, ah, they do hate women, they do hate women. A lot of people that I met afterwards didn't know why. A lot of ladies. And then they, ah, yeah, I didn't like you. That was, I can't count how many. One, so okay, so why don't you like me? Say, because you hate me. No, mm -hmm. how, why? Say, because, so what, tell me what I said that made you think. They, most of them, not a fit talk. Some people, you get one which, which, which you don't mention to me about what happened to Kenny Black. And the funny part, we say, these people intentionally know what they are doing. Some of them will go to your comment, then go insult you, 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 insult you. To get your attention. To get your attention. Once they don't get your attention, you come, maybe the, you come at the person. Mm -hmm. Say, Baba, or if you enter the person, DM. Baba, what I, I do you now? I What's going on? Now the person say, ah, Baba, I just want to get your attention. Mm -hmm. Baba, I don't tell why I don't define you. It don't tell why I don't define you. And the funny thing is, before you reply that person, you go see like 100, 200 people, where like the comment of that person. Mm. <laughs> you know, th th this is the way they talk. It happened to me during the course of this election. People say, Sheila hates Igbo. And I'll just laugh. Me? Hate Igbo. As in, not like dislike who the word hates in itself. Maybe some people, you know, they just throw up words. Mm. And one of the things that I discovered in the process is that people project themselves on you. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. So you need to, sometimes when we start to the experience of certain things, you start to know the reason behind it. Mm. And when you discover that, it's because people make their own projections on you. You understand me? You now begin to think of how to deal with that situation differently. <laughs> now, I'm married to an able lady. I hate to say it. When people don't, they talk and say it. Some people will come comment there, but his wife is Igbo. Uh -uh, his wife is Igbo. Now he hates Igbo this much. That's another comment that will come. Oh. Maybe he get the problem, he get waiting the uh, wife family don't do him. We make her hate <laughs> Igbo. And if there is any, if there is one man that I love most in this world, eh, it's my wife's father. Mm. I've never seen such a humble, God-fearing man in my life. With the so particular about heaven, you understand? Unassuming, unproblematic. In fact, I tell my wife sometimes, I say the reason why I'm still married to you mm -hmm. is not you, is your father. Because your papa too good. Mm -hmm. We be say, if I think to do anything, I could remember your I could papa. say, ah, I don't want to hurt this man mm -hmm. feeling. That is how much of a good man that that man is. And what is the idea of say she hates Igbo? Some people begin to say, because somebody woke up one day after Tinubu lost Lagos in the election and he said Yoruba Ronu. Somebody know. just lump all of us together. Say, as long as she supports Tinubu, that means it's also a Yoruba movement. Ronu. It's just, ah, I can't lose it. I mean, because I. Yoruba Ronu na word we have about Ogunde use since. And then they now said, ah, the same thing, she be that they abuse her in GRUV, say in Mama na Ibu. She be she children too, na half Ibu. He said, go see. I said, my children behave like GRUV. Me they no see any office in Yoruba land. You know why? You don't denigrate a people and then expect to rule them. You don't do that. There are places where Jaruvi lack is lacking. This same Jaruvi, in 2021, he used the word Yoruba Ronu. Why? Why did he use that word Ronu? Because he was tackling Tinubu then. He was trying to convince the Yoruba people that they should think beyond one man's ambition. So he used Ronu. Now, that same word, when you use it for 2021, 
we have used that same word against him in 2023. <laughs> and now people don't see that correlation. And what is the idea? You wanted to govern Lagos State. It's a southwestern state, the Yoruba land. In order to get the vote of other people, yes, we are all Nigerian, other people. You first go your, that time, you remember, say so you, you get Ibo so name. You, you go put Chinedu mm. for My your name. My wonderful name. name. Do you understand? You go put Chinedu for your name, which is not bad. Desmondelli will get other names. Mm -hmm. Olushola. Do you understand? Desmondelli will be saying, no, they use that. You know, they use Olushola. Olushola. Because he won't come Yoruba land, what did he do? He put Olushola, mm -hmm. which means that politicians actually know what they are doing. So, um, DRUV wanted to converse the Igbo votes. He used Chinedu then. But now, when he sees, say, the Yorubas, some Yorubas are kicking against the Igbo Igbos thing. dominating their land or taking their land. He suddenly remembers that his family has a strong tie to the Yoruba land. Do you understand me? That is not how it works. I want to ask one question. Whatever you, whatever you are building, mm. Mm, build, don't build from a faulty foundation. Mm -hmm. Make sure your foundations are right first and build on that foundation so that when you carry everybody along, when you they talk, you begin to say, there are some obas. On a go do one, they go go on that bridge. The traditional institution that your people value. You know, say some of us will go there, we will say we're there educated. But you see, traditionally, you know, go insult my father, and you can't tell me, say, man, I can't vote for you. You know, they're possible. So he had made some certain mistakes, you understand, that has affected him. But that doesn't mean that every other children born from a uh, mixed tribe. We also suffer the same thing. No. Back, back now, to... somebody be Feti Abalogun. Sorry before you call. Mm. Feti Abalogun. We respect her for Yoruba land. Mm -hmm. But the mother is actually the one that is Yoruba. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. father mm -hmm. is from Delta State. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mercy Aigbe. The mother is mm -hmm. from Yoruba. The father is from Edo, Edo, Edo State. State. Mm -hmm. But you see what? Mm -hmm. Somehow, they've enjoyed the company of the Yoruba people. Yoruba people have no reasons to hate them. And that same mercy is celebrated well by the Edo people. I remember Nosa uh, Barbares. Maybe she won't enter politics now. How you go here? No, 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 no. What I'm saying is this. Mm. You understand? She's been able mm. to be to bridge a certain gap. When people say when she won't enter politics, more will see what you go do. Where she lived the most. She lived in Lagos the most. Mm. You understand me? She not if just wake up one day, go Edo. Just to say, welcome. You don't even understand how the grassroots politics work in that place. You need to understand po this politics in our business to some people. Anyway. The way we they do our own comedy, the way it be business to us. Mm. We don't just wake up one day, just hold mic now, just jump enter night of a thousand laugh now. Mm. We don't work at different churches, go perform first before opportunity to come on the stage of night of a thousand laugh came calling. And when that opportunity came, when we enter night of a thousand laugh, you know when you hold the microphone for night of a thousand laugh. You understand? You look for your best material. That I say, make a quickly hit them. You understand? Before you come on. But let's say I can't come from those churches where they perform. I can't come. I won't come relax, come perform like I go die for night of a thousand laughs. I will fail. True. That is what politics should be about. You cannot neglect the grassroots and want to just jump to the roof of, of, uh, make, make of we, the make building. We, make we come out from, mm. from politics back to um, uh, bullying. The, the bullying. Now, again, one thing where they happen for bullying we, that's true with the TikTok, you mentioned shame. A lot of people have, have covered shame, but the stupid word called clout. Some people, you can call them cloutiness. Queen then of there's clout. also cruise. There's also the one they change the name. No, after clout, then they can't add cruise. cruise, in a cruise when, when they don't find out, say, the clout, oh, yeah, not the work again. You don't catch me, you don't catch me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hey, don't cruise. catch me, don't catch me. <laughs> now, cruise. Now, it has gotten to the point where these people, they excuse this thing with the fact that, ah, every publicity in a publicity, if I they do good, nobody go see me. Make a face enter, man, I find one celebrity, make an insult them. But because that time where they talk about woman, about woman, something, 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 something. you get one person, maybe shoes kids with us now. We Congo comment for one blog. We say, this same Nidu, this same Nidu that said, if I don't do this one, I'm not going to shoot with, you remember? 
Mm. <laughs> oh, you came on set. I, nobody even wanted to near you. You should finish, even run, go. Ask anybody where they come my set. Why? When I come, oh, me, me, I know I'm not gonna attack you for comments now. Immediately, my lawyer don't write, give a police don't call him. He begin call me left, right, and center. Begin call everybody. Made them beg me, saying, just, not just clouds, not just cruise. Eh, hey. cruise to spoil another. Cruise person. to spoil another person. Now you know how many people like that comment. How many people don't that comment? We don't believe that thing where you talk. Mm -hmm. When even if you know, say not lying, you are bullying other person. Now the funny part is, there's this is bullying. What we talk, we talk about Alex Wobi. We talk about Tiwa. We talk about she. There are some people they are bullying a subtle bully, bullying, subtle bullying. That they go they do a small small. They go they do a small small. You're not saying anything good. You're not saying anything bad. But you're just there. I'm gonna say, this thing is not even funny. That's you bullying that person. Just like person when posting picking. But, but, you know, the person posting picking. They celebrate the picking. Say the picking don't graduate. Oh, you, my son. You will be great. You will be this. You will be that. The picking wear a uh, convocation gown. Everybody, they happy. Somebody just go come and go to say, this one. We go still smoke Igbo. <laughs> so you see, I see a lot of TikTok. Your own picking when you they celebrate on a day where they say as a as a as a parent. <laughs> Somebody the only the first thing that came to it. So so I want to ask some is this is it is it mental illness? No. Because the way some people approach no, this, this situation. This, 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 this I don't know it. you this, from this, anywhere. This is one thing. You see, a lot of us not really they celebrate the good way people do. Mm. And that is why the noise of the bad mm. overshadows Loud the good. Mm. You know, one of the words where they always tell my wife, mm. I always tell my wife something. I say, don't allow your bad side overshadow your good side. Mm. Mm. So that tomorrow, if we sit down, if you don't, if you've done something bad to me, if I sit down, if I won't look the bad, I will not first spill the layers of good no, and good and good. good. I will not tie yourself. Mm. Mm. It will help me to other. overlook the yes. bad one. Yes. You understand me? So you try to do good. You see, um, human beings naturally, we they, our mind naturally focuses on the bad thing more than the good, the good thing. That is why it is easy to spot the bad comments. Mm. Mm -hmm. And you can see, say, some people don't comment 100 good things yeah. there. Yes. But you see, those 100 good things, we don't like them all. Mm. We don't even click to like. We don't even comment on that to respond to those people. Some people don't even pray. We don't even say amen. Then we can't see one idiot just writing on. That one go trigger mm. us. Mm. It is something that I'm just learning myself. You understand me? So I don't blame anybody. We don't fall in that situation. Mm. Sometimes we overlook all the good that people have said to now focus on one of the bad. Mm -hmm. And you know, bad people, they're very stupid. Mm. <laughs> no, they, no, those clouting and others, they're very stupid. They, they always target. They will first wait to, don't be there, go first comment. They go wait two, three comments. Uh, then they'll come bring their own. You can't see under that their own. The people then where you don't do good for, we're supposed naturally should be the ones to protect fight you. for you mm. and protect you. They will not come. Mm. Some of them, now mm. they will come call you, say, Oh boy, you did on Insta blog. I'll come ask. Uh, well, mm. wait till they right, wait till you talk food. Mm. Thank you. Yeah. Now, on when I did my 40th birthday. When people started saying things that I've done for them, I was crying. And I said something in my mind that day. I said, if this was my barrier, and I had these people say this thing at my barrier, I would have died a fulfilled man. Mm. This was something they are saying, you oh, know, I'm just 40. Mm. And they are saying all this. I said, if they had said it at my barrier, I don't know, maybe God will give me another 40, 60 years. Mm. I said, if they have said it at my barrier, that I would have died a fulfilled man. But these people, as much as they are my friend and they've said all these things, has anyone ever said it online before? Mm. Yeah. No. Mm. But they came to say it, I'm, a, I'm not saying that they should say it online. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you which, understand? Which is why I'm... tomorrow, you see Osama, he gave what Osama do for me. I can never forget Osama. See, mm. may I tell you one, uh. eh? Then the humorous came to my birthday. And he said, during that answers, people started dragging him online. Mm. And he was calling people. See, this thing where they drag him for nobody waiting in me in this mm. one. But he, call, he go. He 
call this one. This one, no, ah, say, Papa, don't worry, you just give her one week, they will forget. Ah, I know if you pull Mato. Then, it was now on my birthday that Dina said, he just went online. He just saw that I was already fighting for him, which is the normal thing that I do for my mm. colleague. I looked at the video, I assessed the video. I didn't need to call him to say that. I assessed the video, I saw the situation of what happened in the video. I said, ah, the same damn way I know. Even though we are not so close, but I know him to Some an extent. extent. Yes. I, I says the video. Ah, I tell the people, why una they this guy don't be waiting? Una know they see the video. I be you not, not be the same eye where I tell they look the video, una tell they look the video. It was on my birthday that he came to say it, that he saw the way I fought for him. And that was the day that his love for me okay. went from 10% to 110%. Mm. Now, I didn't know that. If he hadn't come to my birthday to say it, if for no reason, I wouldn't man. have known. Now, which is it? I have this is something that I've always done for any of my colleagues. That's another thing that N6 does. Mm. N6. I give a shout out to N6. Do you understand? This is one thing that I've always done for any of my colleagues. If there is a situation that is online for my colleague, I know say the backlash will come to me. People go attack me. Mm -hmm. But when I assess the situation, I say, I bet more try to put ourselves in this person's shoe now. Yes. Maybe in a situation now. Uh, some people go see me, they'll say, ah, see the way you did so humble, they play with us. Ah, some of your colleagues, if you see them, would they go snowballs, this one. I say, no, everybody cannot be the same. Mm -hmm. What is the situation of that person as at that, at time, that time that you saw him? You will never know. I say, me, where you they happy say and they play with you. So some other people go tell you, say tomorrow, say Jay Elon a bad person. Mm -hmm. Yes. You understand me? Because of the experience where they get with me. And I started an example to the person that day. I said, one day. Uh, uh, they receive a call. Imagine from Lekki, you receive a call that they rushed your cousin to the hospital. Loot. That was an emergency, this one. I entered a car, drive. You needed to see the way I drove. And now got to the entrance of loot. The security, they call the, ah, Baba, I give it. I said, Mona, wait, man, go see you waiting. They have, Baba, I know they talk like this now. Just, you know what I said? At some point, I said, well, I press the carry person, come here when they say, make a, I make mean, come up for a room for me, make a, do you understand? Mm -hmm. That security, go, 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 talk, say, shit, you know, you know, see, yeah, I, yeah, because you know, I give money, see the way they behave. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? That is his experience. But does that make me a bad person? It was an emergency at that place. And, that and, time. And, and, this is my cousin, where the rush go, so I just lost my uncle that was uh, her father. Mm. Um. Do you understand? They say he had a, 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 a bike accident. Do you know the panic where they in my heart? Now the papa now he trained me mm. from when I was six. Do you understand? Different things now they run through my mind. Is it easy to drive from Lekki to go see person for loot? Do you understand what I'm saying? Now, if somebody has his own experience, he will go out tomorrow, he will say, Sheila, now this person. Yes. Mm. Another person now go confirm who Sheila really mm. is. He go to say, I bet with Twitter, I don't even see online a bad person. The same thing that happened, you know, if you notice, you hardly will see stories about me on social media until one day where they say I slap security for a hotel. Yes. Which is what somebody wanted to bring up recently. What happened? That day, I had gone to five events to support people. Yeah. And God bears me witness. I went to Ajao Estate to a church, church uh, one church at um, Maryland. The boy said he was doing something, he called it Laugh with the Widows. <laughs> I went to that program. I went to support the boy. I said, hey, I don't get four events already. But which time will they start? He said, at two o'clock. I said, okay, I will come. I don't reach there by 1.30 or so. Waited for them to start the shows, quickly perform. I want to rush out. They are pastor coming. One story where I tell you. Yeah, wait. Say, the pastor coming. come. He said, man, I come. He say, he say, the boy say, come greet our pastor. As I enter the office, and the pastor tell me one prophecy will shock me. Mm. Say, in your industry, they've almost killed you since 2010. This was something that happened in 2012. When the pastor tell me some things, ah, even me. Now, wait till I know. And wait the story where I don't share with anybody. Mm. Mm. And I confirm wait till the pastor talk. But me, I know the person where they react with wait till anybody tell me. Now, still, she, I don't know him before. She be that kid and walking me, but God don't allow them. No, that one is fine. Let's continue. I left that church. I went to Hush Baby's son's name. I left that place. I went to another church at Ajao Estate. I left that place. I went to I went to Songo. Yeah, we want to you not talk the other one. Yes, I go, I went to Songo Water. That boy, where I go perform for song for Songo Water, where I go support. Do you know that it was almost five years later that I say the boy don't die? He for the industry. And I don't even know. 
This was somebody who I don't give my support to. So sometimes we know even the, I just support, I don't leave the boy, I don't do my own, don't come out. I don't even follow up the boy, the boy that I said, we don't even know for the industry. Nobody know. Until somebody come later tell me, you see the way life day, the person where you see today gives support to tomorrow, you don't die. Mm -hmm. And I left that place and I went to Kiss Daniel's show. And in all these places where they go so, now free oh, now me buy fuel for moto. They fuel cow, they do everything oh, free oh. And as they go so, ah, baba, she heal up. You give this one money. Mm -hmm. I had exhausted all the money in my hand. And I went to kiss Daniel's show, perform, finish. As I they come, the security that they hear me. I say, I beg. Not in day my hand again, oh. I beg. Another time I go see on her. One of the security out of anger just tell me, say, baba, pass this side. I said, they open the gate for them. They say, pass here, they open the gate. I saw I come up for line where I deal. I thought he was, he was trying to help me. I saw I drive go. They come tell me, say, they don't open the gate. <laughs> I now drove back. As I see the guy, I say, how do you ask you if they open this gate? You tell me, make a go now. Why did they do like this? He said, oh, God, I beg the go, Joe. <laughs> that was what he said. I said, ah, oh, God, I beg the go, Joe. Oh, now because of money, I don't give you, and I make you do me this thing. He said, I beg, Baba, now, so he just turned back to me. I can't look. I saw another security guy. Maybe I shouldn't even have reacted that way. But the anger at that moment. Mm -hmm. See, I see people where they always see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, why you go do this? I said, they try to call the other security. Where did they? As I opened the door, I don't know whether the door touched him. And so he slammed the door, come down my leg. I'm telling you. That was what happened. As he slammed the door, come down my leg. As I come down, I slap him straight. You understand me? As I slap him, I follow him. Will, now, when he slammed the door to me and I slapped him, this one, one guy with the Guardian newspaper or so. Where did he? He uh, you no know, asked me what happened. He just picked the news. Ah, she, he, love, why he, goes, like, he just put on for paper. Breaking news. Do you <laughs> understand? The guy said, I did cheat that. I said, you don't even ask me what it happened. Do you understand? But, oh, now she heal on her. You must news. make him suffer. That is human being for you. They won't assess the situation to be able to judge properly in his mind, which is one of the reasons, if you remember before we started the program, I said Nigerians that the poor oppresses more than the rich. Yes. And I'll use something as an example. If you did drive your car, Nedu, you understand me? You jam person where they drive keke. The people where they road, what did they go do? If you don't take time, they go almost They go almost burn your motor. Sir. They'll begin to, ah, ah, because saying they drive keke, may not drive for road again, you'll hear different noise for your head. Reverse the situation. May the keke jam you. You <laughs> come down, converse. If you go tell you, ah, ah, okay, with this, your car, now you reverse for this keke. <laughs> so you want to make this keke now buy this light. I want to do an hour. Uh, or oh guy, you know the pity person. They will blackmail you again. That is the kind of society mm -hmm. that we live in. Mm -hmm. That has condoned bullying. That has romanticized bad habits. We don't, that's why me as a Yoruba person, there is a certain, there are certain words they use in Yoruba land that I don't like. And I say it vehemently. Like when they say something bad, Yoruba, instead of them to say the thing bad, they will come say, oh, could you a too? What it means is that it remains small, yeah. make it, mm, what is mm. bad? They bad. Mm -hmm. What is good? They good. Mm -hmm. No try and embellish bad so that you can say you want condo. No, don't stop condoning it. If this person, they do something where they wrong, who will talk calm? Who will say this thing they wrong? If she has done wrong, come to me. Even if you want to write it in the, she, this thing where they do, they wrong. You understand me? And if you approach you, say, okay, you say they wrong, Abby. How is it wrong? When you give me your reasons why it is wrong, we should be able to subject each other to superior arguments. Argument. And learn from each other. Nobody say every time you want just made, made this person just know say they abuse. Mm, well, one day savage. Sabi use word though. If I just drop her like this, he enter. Baba, you are stupid. Stupidity no get another covering. Mm -hmm. You understand me? Don't allow your smartphone be smarter than you. Mm -hmm. You are the one controlling it. <laughs> Why are you being stupid for your phone? Smartphone are making people dumber. The way I, the way I, the way I the best for some of my nephews sometimes. 
One day we were in the car, we were driving. There was a car in front of us. And then one of my cousins with this, ah, he said, this mess, this mess, go get turbo. I said, that's a stupid talk. Talk to me from a place, from an informed place. The moment you saw the car, you saw that it's a Mercedes Benz, GLE 450. What you should do is Google the car, mm-hmm. check the specification, mm-hmm. check the things that it has. And then when you open and say, bros, ah, this car, bros, it get turbo. The turbo now so so way now that the activate them. Because your phone is smart enough to give you all those things. Mm-hmm. Ah, nah, uh, 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 this car go get turbo. Are you stupid? <laughs> you have finished university. <laughs> should this be the kind of discussion that you should be having? <laughs> Do you understand what I'm saying? Stop acting. Do you understand? Like the moment. Like <laughs> exactly. <laughs> no, I, I, the, that, this, that, that is because those days, um, when I was in secondary school, mm. we used, I used to have some, I used to have about five friends. What do we do? We contribute money. When it's time for test, we contribute money. 2020 naira for each of the test subjects. You understand me? So the person will get the highest score for this subject. We take the money for that wow. subject. Hmm. It was a healthy competition. Mm. It go make us go house, go reason. Now the reason why we say by SS2, I don't finish Ababio. Mm. Mm. By SS2, I don't finish modern biology. PNO KK by SS2, I don't finish him. I follow you by SS2, I don't finish him. Do you understand? Why? Because as I did now, if it tell you for Ababio, introduction to chemistry, I'll tell you particulate nature of matter, I'll tell you acid bases and salt, kinetic motion, I'll tell you elect- uh, 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 gases and its law, I'll tell you hydrogen and its compound, I'll tell you carbon and its compound. I'll know all those things. But he's having a book. Which last time I opened those books? I don't open them today. But that time, when we won't argue for class, mm-hmm. we go to argue, I go tell you, say, go open page 127. Confirm. My dear electrolysis day. Do you understand? That is the way we they argue. It brought out heavy arguments yes, amongst us. Yes. And it makes us talk from a place of, in, from an informed place. So that when we they talk amongst ourselves, you don't understand? Pride. So before I go, you talk with pride. When, when you talk, finish. You understand? Everybody they talk here. If I allow you to talk, they do talk. She talk, she talk. By the time I will talk on top, it will come be like saying I mean no pass. Not mm-hmm. because saying I mean no pass. Mm. Because as much as I can talk, I'm also a good listener. Yes. When I listen, I'll draw knowledge from everybody. Mm-hmm. By the time I'll come talk, um, it will come be like say, ah, this shit, the yard, cha. Mm-hmm. Now, like, not be saying the yard. <laughs> he has only practiced something that makes him better, mm-hmm. that makes him talk from an informed place. Mm-hmm. That's why you go on social media and you look at this generation where they talk, they insult everybody, and then you look at yourself. When they bring an informed discussion into it and somebody talk, this person comment like this, you come to look say subsidy. How will it be it, when our generation don't go and are these people? Can they rule our children? Mm. Are these the people that we will leave our children in their hands? That is why the rich will send their children abroad to get them more informed, and they will come. They will see come and rule over you people who decided to say now government don't make us no. You don't get phone. Mm. There is no bigger library that in the phone, world than your smart. phone right now. Mm-hmm. Mm. So what are you doing with it? You wake up in the morning. You don't go on Instagram. Sometimes when I wake up, when I they talk, my wife will say, ah, "Where did you get this information?" Oh, so that time where I did toilet, they press my phone. Mm-hmm. For your mind, nah, Twitter. No, I did. You know, I did sample knowledge here and there. Mm-hmm. Today, for example, where would they talk? The UK has entered recession. Somebody, somebody put the comment there. Say UK has gone into a recession. Yes. Say that now Nigeria has gone. No, say then somebody go comment there every time that the bad thing now that they used to compare Nigeria. Why are you not talking about Japan and Singapore? The person where they talk say why are you not talking about Japan and Singapore? Don't know. Say Japan don't enter recession before the UK. Mm. You see where foolishness they talk. But if you had gone there now to try and correct that person, you go to say now because they support this government. That's why you want somebody where they talk in favor of the government. That is not what we're talking about. Sometimes when we they try to compare some certain things and we they talk from a, from an informed place, you'll say the UK, see where they're there. And we know they compare the good one. Can your family bring out people to come into slavery, to develop Nigeria, the way the UK used free labor that time? Mm. Why are we talking about reparation today? For UK to pay and the US to pay for labels that they use free of charge then. Mm-hmm. Say maybe they begin pay for that. Not being black people still they fight for it till today. See tomorrow. Mm. For you for US. Mm. But if to say UK pay the money that I said that they pay money to build those things, you think say they for build that country, may it be like what it be now today? Mm. Then a state where they try small, small, like Lagos State in Nigeria, which is more or less the the 
the model state the for Nigeria, yeah. the poster boy for Nigeria. If they do one, we will criticize them. I'm not saying it is wrong, but criticize from a place of, from an informed, informed place. place. Like somebody where they criticize from an informed place, Nafusha Dorothy, the former ADC uh, candidate. Mm-hmm. When you see, when he release in document to criticize the government, even you, where you, they support the government, when you read that, you thought say very good. This man, they, yeah, we, ah, we like the way this man. So we know, even we, where would they support? We know even know say they vote out this kind of money. Mm. But that is somebody who is criticizing from an informed place. You go celebrate them. But when you celebrate them, they will tell say, they did this one, that the one where they lie be that. And when our government, all of them are not going to make them. No, be. If cost, they work. Eh? Mm-hmm. Africa for them. You know? Mm-hmm. All these generational costs, where they talk? <laughs> if, we, they, if all these generational costs really they work, the UK supposed don't die since. Yes, because yes. what did their forefathers do us? And mm-hmm. uh, the, the generational costs supposed don't kill their sins, they supposed don't go under. But those things are not the things that will make it work. Work. Very true. Actions taken uh-huh. are the things that will make things yes, work. Mm-hmm. And that is where I want us to get to. Mm-hmm. So I think that a lot of people don't even know what's going on. They, it's just like, you're, I'm, I'm walking towards your other material and I see you, you are running. And I turn back and I start running. Mm-hmm. A lot of people that say, for example, Oganedu does not like women. They don't say it because they have even seen where he said or he said anything that has to do with not liking women. They just said it because two or three people have said that. That don't Oganedu even know as well. Don't like women. And on this show, sometimes I complain about somebody saying something about me. A guest said to me, he said, those people, do they have your phone number? Mm. I said, no. So, which means you don't know them. They don't know you. So they don't have the right to say anything that should get to you. Where it should get to you now is if you're being bullied, like you said that you fight for people. Those are your friends, or maybe not even your friends. Those are people that you think that, oh, they're bullying these people. No, no, I should stand and fight for them. Mm-hmm. But where it will get, it will be hurtful for me as a person is if I see you tone there. I mean, if you don't want to defend me, mm-hmm. view the, 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 the um, bashing and pass. Mm-hmm. Where it will pay me if I see liked by tone. <laughs> uh, my own, I don't, I don't see you. Yes. If you see people, to, if to, people that will abuse me for two days not page. Now, in fact, no verse. I, 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 no, I let beg. me just be. I, 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 I will give an example. I lost about two friends. That our GREX episode. Oh. Mm-hmm. I lost like two to three friends. And I lost them and I dust them my slippers and I said bye bye to them. You didn't lose them, you caught them off. Oh, I caught them off. Mm-hmm. This one of my friends, this particular one, when we were really cool, he would carry my mat on his head, like, oh, my friend, my friend. At say points, we're not really, you know, that good. So when that um thing episode. dropped, that episode. episode dropped and it was all over the place, that vibrator thing, and this guy took the video mm. and posted it on his Facebook. Uh-uh. I'm telling you, my friend. Posted it on his Facebook and he wrote, eh, children, eh, blah, blah, blah. This, they, they don't know what the future holds. Uh uh. Like, you're bashing your name, blah, blah, blah. It's still on his Facebook. Not only on Facebook, he took it to his WhatsApp and he posted it on his WhatsApp and he wrote. As in, I, I don't view his WhatsApp status, but something that they just said, mm-hmm. shall go and view. As I went to his WhatsApp, I saw that thing. I wrote him, I said, I mean, I didn't expect this from you, but good riddance to bad rubbish. I deleted, I blocked him and blocked. One guy that I respect so much, he called me in the night and he said, hm, Madam Vibrator, I see your handwork. I told him, sir, I respect you, <laughs> I, but I will block you. <laughs> I said, no, I said, no, 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 have you gone on YouTube to view the Beautiful. almost two hours long video? He said, no. I said, that's the more reason I will block you and block anybody that is related to you. <laughs> because why you know me and you are seeing me in that position. What should you do? Ha, this is interesting. If Ezine is saying this kind of thing, mm-hmm. must be interesting. Mm-hmm. Let me go well, and understand, understand from our perspective. You understand the context. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> waiting the sop. You didn't do it. What you do is to call me. So if it was a stranger that called me Madam Vibrator on a comment session, I will watch it and pass. pass Not your friend. Ah, it had to say to you, you will be like, oh, do me go. Oh, do you see this thing where you talk, eh? It was like your episode with T Babati. Mm. And then people started posting, ah, I said, Sheila stole his joke. Yeah, this yeah, one yeah. And yeah. That. And then people, they say, Shay, you know, Thief Baba's tea joke, this one. I laugh. Mm. And then, somehow, people, they send me the, this thing. And I went to watch the full episode. episode because I wanted to understand where it's mm. coming from. And I watched it. And I'm like, ah. One of the things that I noticed is, this guy felt, this guy left me where we were and didn't come back to me. And the truth is, he didn't reach out to me. He reached out to a manager, mm. like he said. He didn't reach out to me. And as at that time, you understand, he probably was missing things up. The time that we started, when I knew Baba T, AY was not even in the picture. Mm. AY has not even started doing... Open mic. Open mic. AY was probably still with Alibaba. The same way I met MC Danfo in 2003. Mm. Where the day where Sam Loco, if he sent me an MC down for to go and buy him good, to go and buy him drink, beer, you understand? It'd be like, say, I don't make camp for this life. Mm. As an Orile boy, we trek from Orile come National Theatre at his village. Sam Loco can't send us to buy him beer. Oh boy, it'd be like, say, the whole success where I define for my life. Depended on, that, on bottle. that bottle of beer where I go up and buy. That's how much I cherish the presence of a Sam Loco, <laughs> if he, and that he called me to do something for him. Respect. Now, MC Danfo, where would he do all this worker? He got role to do, I think it was a gate man then in one movie. He wore, to tell you how much I followed it, he wore a blue top and black trousers as a gate man for that movie. Mm. He get role because that time, if we come up for Artist Village, we also go Winnie's Hotel for mm. Sue Larry. Mm. He got that role. I didn't get any role. I went back, fell back to my dancing and then the business center, phone call business, what would they do for a really bus stop? Mm. He don't enter the movie, don't they go? Then one day my cousin introduced me to stand-up comedy where I come from there. I didn't get to see MC Danfo again until maybe 10 years later. Mm. Or even more. And the next time when I go see MC Danfo, when I wanted to introduce him on stage, I said he is my senior colleague in the movie business, but I'm his senior colleague in the, the comedy, comedy business. business. Mm. This is how much I value the fact that there was a time our path crossed mm. and this guy made a name. Now he's come back into the comedy business and he's making way for himself. Mm. The thing where you they do, where they do with singing since where people don't see today. Why some people not ready to listen to a Sheila perform? Then they want to see a Danfo do that comedy. Do you mm -hmm. understand me? Now, when my part with uh, Babati crossed, I went, me, I be the person with a struggle where well. I went to OU, Osu then, and I saw that Babati was there. That was where our part crossed. Unfortunately, we came to Lagos. We can't go laugh cafe. Nicholas, where they talk about so, and one of the person where he pulls off us. But at the same time, does it mean that because he rip us off, we know they're grateful for the platform we give we're us? Given. We're grateful. If you remember, Taju did not to they do something where they call laugh pattern. Mm -hmm. Yeah, laugh I never pattern. get opportunity to get on laugh pattern. But Ben Gadenka was doing laugh matters before it turned into a show. Yes. Mm -hmm. He was doing it as On a TV, TV program. Yes. <laughs> and then this Laugh Cafe, me with a Maker Smith. I was closest to a Maker Smith because the first place my cousin took me to perform, it was a church, New Life Paris Redeem, at Ikmori. I performed there. Then they, some, some lady met me there and told me to come to her church to come and perform. They promised to pay me $750. They ended up paying $500. $750, naira, not 750000 uh. They ended up paying $500. It was a VG. <laughs> when I got there, the person that was their MC was MC Doggy. Who later became a maker smith. 
Now he introduced me. When I perform, when they make us me see my performance, now only in call me say, oh boy, the way you perform, so you you sabi you, I beg more MC this thing together because I don't get joke when I want crack. Mm-hmm. And I love his humility to understand his his standard Limit. as adapt. Yes, you yes. don't understand. Yeah. And me with him do this thing. From there we became friends. It make us me go cross. I go call cross. Can I cross? Waka truko kako morile come see me. Me to I go cross. Can I go see him? On our part. When we come to go live cafe, where I think uh, we I don't, you know, now me tell him, make us say if we they wait for all these things, more they go different schools. Mm-hmm. That time we go come out, we we'll go o, o, uh, OAU for Ife. Mm. And there we meet a Pabioranki. Which I mean by Bioranki. O Pabioranki. <laughs> you feel no know him. Now old comedian we do a BSc for Ife, do a uh, master's for Ife, do a PhD for Ife. Wow. Um. Pabioranki. When that time we they sleep for inside amphitheater, mm. amphitheater that hall. What will they do? We will come there. We will sit down. Like say we walk on read. Then when we don't do like say we they read after a while. I load everything there inside bag. Go. We will come lie down sleep. When we wake up for morning, we will go our whole hall before everybody wake up. We will shower. We will change our clothes. You understand? I told you. Then when we don't just say this hall that they do this thing, we will go there. From there, we'll fight me, they introduce us. Once they introduce us, we'll perform here. Yeah? Other people like her, now they go pay us money. Mm-hmm. We will take get our transport. They come back. Come get a stretching. From there, we'll go UI. And so I think meet that form for UI. <laughs> we'll come up for UI, we'll go OU before we'll come, come last year. Come, come. Unilag. Unilag. Now, in the journey through last year, I think, because I don't, uh, uh, this person, uh, what is his name? ID Kabasa was in my church. Now, through that journey, now I take meet nice. Why well, I take back up for nice for last Lord dinner? Mm. People don't know. No. I back up for nice. When would they do all this journey? Uh, Baba T, our part crossed again in a laugh cafe. We would make her go laugh ourselves from Suru Liri. <laughs> in fact, a maker they do photocopy. Now, they manage the photocopy, the manage yeah, the photocopy for one business. Yes. In the manage the photocopy, he go tell me, say, Baba, I don't. Save like 100 oh, for this week. Oh. <laughs> me too, I will talk, say from my phone call business, I get 200. No worry, we hear that they record Laugh Cafe for Ikeja. We now so we go lap ourselves. How much Nicola supposed to give us? 5K. But Nicola's go give us on 1,000. But we'll sign for 5,000. Oh, wow. He go collect for 4,000 for our head. <laughs> you don't understand me? But that time, we know the vessel. When we collect, finish it, make her one more enter bus, make her go say, may we sit down. I say you decrease for this one thousand. How much will first spend? Confess three hundred. Another three hundred. Now you go carry us go back. It go remain one four. So you want more sit down now so that we will spend the one. We will come in nine hundred. We will spend. I say we will still laugh. See we will go go perform for motherland, Lagbaja, mm. motherland. Okay, we Lagbaja go perform till yes. four a.m. We will come in and we come take him from four a.m. till five or five thirty. I remember on one of I those episodes where twice. we go that laugh, uh, uh, motherland. Now there I want comedian see me say, you know they drink, you know they smoke. Say, and you won't last for this industry. I give you two years. But you know, I didn't taste alcohol until I lost my mother in 2022. Hmm. Wait, a comedian told you this. Mm. Say, you know they drink, you know they smoke. How you say, won't take last? Uh, Saying give you two years. Uh, so now, at that great. time, the person is a senior comedian. Uh, a senior colleague, very senior colleague. <laughs> You understand? Now he's still senior, BC junior. Uh, I don't want let's leave anybody for the for the part that they have no, chosen. I just want to know. You understand? Now, the thing is this: in the movement of that journey, you understand, I lost touch with Babati. Yeah. You understand me? You know if you talk say Atif your joke. So you know to mm. Atif your joke. Do you do you like a cappella, for example? I know the person where they like talk, say, I do this one for this person, I do this one for this person. But I know how many comedians once lived in my okay. house. Mm. And none of them lived in my house at any point in time where I ever say, buy pure water for the house. Mm. I know they like talk, man. But sometimes, eh, because eh, we'll just do our good, we'll say, we know they want to make people know. Every young comedian that once lived in my house, they will follow me, go show. And I mean, they pee. They don't tell them to come perform. They will just follow me, come off for house. When I collect balance, I go put balance for table. Oh, yeah, you take 20K, you take 10K, you take 15K. That's why I go share them for everybody. And yet, they live in my house. Hmm. 
and they leave from, from my house, they no use their money buy pure water one day. Because I don't tell them to buy pure water. In fact, if I they travel, I'll drop money. Maybe I they go for four days. I'll drop money for four, for the four days where I they travel. If I my traveling extend, if they spend extra money, when I come back, I will refund, refund them. <laughs> and sometimes when I they travel, so you know, say I like cooking. I will cook in the fridge for them mm -mm. so that they don't have any reasons to worry about food. These are people we never ever relate to me. Mm -hmm. And most of these comedians were not Yorubas. Mm -hmm. But I never had any Yoruba comedian lived in my house. If we talk about this tribalism way, some people they pull for head. And if we count this comedian, I know that these people, out of all of them, the only one that stood up to even make a comment about all the issue where people they bash me mm. for social media during the election was William Mouth. William Mouth didn't just stop at that. There was somebody who wanted to um, interview him on. Um, on the uh, on the punch newspaper, mm. you understand? We might have to incorporate the house where I stay for a korodu. Say it was a house where comedians, you understand, lived that they lived in that house and moved on to great success. Mm. You know, they call every other person. Now the younger colleagues now lead them grand interview. Mm. People like I expected that people like Acapella, Pensu, Funny Bone, we also talk about that house. It is not just to praise me. It was just to talk a little bit about our story, living in that house and moving on to do Greater great things. things. You understand? They just mentioned them in, pass in passing, but they said they didn't grant that interview. I don't know the reason why they didn't. You understand? Everybody can have their reason. It is not a problem. But I expected that this was a part of our story. It isn't just because Nasheilo and I get the house then. It was because we lived as family. At a point, I was doing comedy retreat in that house. Mm. Yes. Senator Emeka Smith, Shakara, uh, Acapella, Funny Bone, all the Prince Will, Will Mouth, the Ebo uh, Bone, Youngest Lalo. I they do comedy retreat. I invite everybody. Now me go cook. Instead of sometimes, maybe my girlfriend too, that later became my wife. Mm. I go cook. You understand? All of us go to eat, we they brainstorm on the jokes. Eh? which was part of the reason why there was a lot of greatness around our generation yes, of comedians. Yes, yes. Because we'll brainstorm. This mm. one will bring joke. Uh, I'll come say, ah, this line, now will finish this joke well. Mm. Do one like this. And so, now be one of the um, jokes. When I say, when I came back from London, say, I cross a daughter. Police, come follow you. For, uh, say, last man, come hold mm, me. Mm. Come to say, I say, wait till you, you say, you are under arrest for crossing the road. I say, wait till you, where you do, wait till you mm. do. Mm. Do you know who gave me the punchline for that joke? It was a cappella. Yes. It was a cappella that created the punchline for that joke. When you call the talk, say, ah, bros, now me bring it. Who go use the, the, the joke? I say, now nah, the first person we use and I ain't get them. Mm. It was part of what it happened between me and Babati. I don't want to go too much into detail. Yeah, it's better but you the don't. truth is this. Papa T is somebody that I respect. You understand? Our path crossed at a certain period in our life. You understand? And I moved on to do some other things. Not because I wanted to neglect the friendship, but because we we're all at a stage where we were hustling, looking for our finding, trying to find our feet. Yes. And my path with AY even crossed. When I did talk about some people think saying that AY bring me into the industry. It wasn't even a why. The person that God used for me in the industry was Jedi. Oh, mm. Jedi Baba. Jedi, Jedi Baba not even give you names. Eh? Jedi was the one that even named me Sheilo. To tell you, you understand, that they share the story all the time. It was just that AY, AY's platform was more prominent for people to see me than Jedi. But without Jedi, I wouldn't have known AY. You mm. see him? But today, everybody go say Sheilo, AY boy. But nobody they ever see me to say na Jedi boy. If na another person be Jedi, that could stem mm. jealousy inside of him. Mm. Yeah. Say, but na me introduce this boy to AY now. Yes. You understand? And that is why I'm using this platform today. That was why when Jedi did his 40th birthday, I traveled from the UK to the US. He didn't think I was going to come. I went on that platform to perform and share my testimony of how I met him. You understand? I went. I spent only a day in the U.S. Mm? and I returned back to the U.K. That is how much I value what he did for me. Because that day that Jedi met me, it wasn't a day that I thought I had a time with destiny. 
Mm. But God used him to change my story. A maker had told me after I met a maker Smith, his church in Thomas Animashaun, a maker has called me that they were going to do a program, saying he want me to come. And I trekked from Ibutimeta, my column street in Ibutimeta, trekked through Onyibu, through Costain, through Nigerian Bureau's Road, through Jimo Dutola, through Koka, to Aguda to go and attend that show. When I got From there, a meta. yes. When I got there, <laughs> well, the other I guys. <laughs> when I got there, the other guys where they want to do the show together, they sat like this. The leader of the group, they were called the Isaacs. They were a drama group. The leader of the group sat down, and then the maker brought me in, and he said, "Ah, now the guy where they tell you now be this in funny way, well, well, this one now." One. And then the leader looked at me from head to toe, and he made a statement. I said, "This thing no fit climb our water." This uh, thing. That thing. was exact. His choice of words. He said, wow. this thing, no fit climb our water. Wow. When he said this, he said, ah, I go find shoe for him. He said, I went to borrow shoe from Exxon. You don't get shoe, na slippers you wear. Yeah, slippers no are shoes. welcome. No be saying that slippers, na palm, but the slippers don't come up for the palm. <laughs> <laughs> so now your palm are wear. Mm. When he said that, I could have been angry because there be young boy like my age mm. too. Baba, I sabi book die. I know they, I know they try their humility when it comes to book. Mm. No, I sabi book die. I read well, well. So you know if he, uh -uh. but now situation warrant will make me come. Mm. You understand? Mm. As he said it, there is an adage in Yoruba. They say, "Ah, mm. don't you go back bad Mm. It means that a dustbin or mm -hmm. trash can that when refuses to no take dirt, you don't know, go, you know, go ever food. You understand me? Mm. Now, when he said that, I could have been angry. I said, wait till they worry this one, you know? But I waited. So, 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 Bereko was the one that drums in the church. In that church. Yes, now, so, so, yes. So, 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 now, when Jerry came, uh, when they were doing the program, they were waiting for Jerry to see their performance. So in between, there was gap. They were now looking for somebody to fill it up. So, so now I said, "Mo, I use this guy, and I should be the same a comedian to fill the gap. As God will have it. After a mounted stage, I started performing. Jerry came in. Wait, or does he wait to see with the when they see him perform? So by the time I perform, and I had standing ovation like four times in between my because I performed from a place of anger. Mm. Hunger. <laughs> and, I, and hunger. Because I always tell people, I said, for every time, be always prepared. And when the opportunity shows up, perform like you are performing at your best event ever. Mm. So that your preparation and opportunity can lead you to the place of satisfaction. Mm. First, your self-satisfaction. Because if you are happy, other doors can open. open. Mm. Now, when I go, when I perform, Jedi, when I say, my stage name, then I say, it easy. Mm. Now, question might be my stage name. Mm. Shay, it easy. As I say, my, thank you very much, my name is Shay, it easy. Jedi ran on stage and heard me on stage. And God used him to prophesy into my life. Say, this is a talent that is waiting to explode in this country. You will blow, you will go places. What was the thing that Jedi said? And when we finished the performance and we finished the show, we were going. Guess who Jedi was working with? Jedi was working with me. The same thing side. when they said, no, go climb water. The mm -hmm. other people who really organized the show, they were working behind us to get Jedi's attention. Ah. When God opens a door for you, the people that thought they were blocking the door, we go to the window to peep inside Kaya. and see you. Kaya. When God opens the door for you, the people who thought that they were blocking the door, the door we, we go, go to, to the, the window, window to see Kaya. you, to get a glimpse. Let me Kaya. He just Rema is the Rema word. <laughs> he just come out. <laughs> He's a you, you, you might not understand this thing. Hmm. If you remember those days where we were small, hmm. the person we first get color TV for our area at that time. I be boss. You understand? In Peking, when we won't play ball, whether it's Sabi play, Sabi play. Now choose who go join the now team. Now you go choose who go join the team. Why? So that when time to reach to watch ball or to watch you TV go program, now you go come more cutting for us. Yes. Now, I became the person who was rejected at first 
became the person where they informed Jedi when they needed Jedi to do other things for them. Mm. Now, this journey with Baba T will mm. bring about this story. Mm. As I go, I remember, say, that time where would they go do those shooting with Baba T? One day we went to go and record Laugh Cafe. And when we finished recording and they paid us one 1,000, we did outside. Baba the Baba. Yeah, Baba the Baba. Came late. But then, in the get strong association with those people than us. So Baba the Baba was the one that pushed me to hustle harder. Mm. Mm. The same way, probably breaking the bond between me and T, Baba T mm. forced him to do better in his field of strength. Mm. So sometimes people will not know the reason why some certain things just had to happen. They think you're trying to take advantage. It, is, it wasn't me trying to take advantage of him. Mm -hmm. Because even his growth has no reason to affect me. As, as your do, own growth, not going affect any him. reason. The same way we be say, as I they move, so the person will be my support in the business. We be say, I go sit down, tell my joke to. We go tell me say sometimes say ah this joke where you don't form none. I no go try and for that place. So, ah I no I no believe this joke. Where I will still do I go crack the joke there. We will come tell me say ah you walk now. If no me say go walk like mm. that tomorrow. Mm. They make us meet. We meet to add a draw and follow body mm. to see say we all succeed. Today I told you if I come to your program that I was going to call a make us meet. Yes. Maybe say now make I go share the things and where I do for people. We are sacrifices that are made for people. A make us meet today has a British passport and, and an Irish, Irish passport. passport. Mm -hmm. Do you understand me? Mm. But people don't know, say, now me fill the first form where make I get the first visa. We use my company to fill the... To, to, where I say make I was an associate comedian in my company. But the time when I they work with AY, they serve AY, some of them, now they talk, say, they do like boy, boy to AY. But the knowledge we are gained from working with AY. Opening the company and all those the, things. We are open company. And I opened the door for and today where it did today. Mm. Mm. So sometimes people can ridicule your act of service. Mm. It doesn't matter. Tomorrow when they start to read the benefit, they won't be the people to talk it's about it. People ridiculing your act of service, thereby bullying you on social media and otherwise. Sometimes I think a lot of people need to understand the fact that um, um, how she, how I am right now, how she lo perceives me as a person is not how Tom might perceive me as a person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You understand? So, not the project how she lo they perceive me yeah. to your own side. Mm -hmm. ah, no, mm -hmm. no, the fact say, if what that she lo this now, 20 people feel I'm as angel. Another person is a ah, issue, devil, nine be that guy. So, not they take a know that person for yourself. Mm. And even if you don't know the person, you see on some social media that they insult Shayla, idiot, he go with the support APC. But you, mm -hmm. who are you supporting? Don't you have your own emotions? Can't you uh, 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 channel your own emotions? Can't you uh, express, express your views? Express your views mm -hmm. in independently. A independently. Mm -hmm. Now, that's another word. A lot of people cannot make up their decision independently. Herd their decision, mentality. I mean, they, they have that herd mentality. Something somebody go post something now. Insult this she law. Say I see B Robby shy. You're black like do others go go on that way at first when they saw that picture. That wasn't what was in their mind. Right, yeah. But because they don't see influence. that bullying comment, that influence, they go on that. They first of all like the comment. Mm -hmm. Now wow, do you know I'm just even noticing it? Mm -hmm. Somebody go say who they also are bullying notice? now as comedy. Mm -hmm. It be like the one where somebody comment for Twitter, where you see my picture, where you see my picture for Twitter, where you say, see your face, be like, yash. <laughs> <laughs> that one there. And, and your face calling is even yash like this, man. I say, that, you know what I said? As he talk, I say, you see your face like yash. It be like the next comedy show where I go. I say, oh, boy, I can't look myself for mirror. The face called the resemble yash. I can't imagine, say, all those times where they give woman head. So, now two yash, they rub each other. <laughs> So another, you get what way you talk. Uh, another problem, <laughs> eh, sh sh before you talk, another problem where they foster bullying. Sheila don't mention them. I've mentioned it in pa passively. When good people keep quiet, the bad ones we prevail. foster will prevail. Mm -hmm. Now, I've during what, what it make me till tomorrow, and I put to summer Akbonono like this. You you know why. Now, you go see somebody. They feel they insult Sheila now. Person like, 
another comedian which he love, he don't do something with. Siamo, instead of making talk, say, this guy won't have to call all these names. He is not like that. But because that one won't protect, he said, I beg you, not be me, may not carry and rob me. Then go avoid. <laughs> you understand? And so it better for you make them insult that person then when you see for the person, now, now the, for, you know the sad part? Now the person will even call you almost say, how much did they finish you for Insta blog? Go <laughs> check it. I know how know, know more you say. Why you talk that kind of thing now? But you, you know, say, not be waiting me and me be this. Why you not go the comments? Hmm. Go go talk, say, no, this person. Because that person, they also fear me, they not insult her. Mm. Mm -hmm. as Selfishness. As a material, I want to say something. I mean, in case I don't get a chance to talk again. Um, you know, say, story they sweet. When you are the one they are bullying. When you are the one they are bullying. Yes, when I'm the one that is getting bullied, mm. I'm I'm getting people's emotion. Mm. So everybody say, hey, yeah, isn't it? Why did you do it to isn't it? When I'm in the position where I can comfortably bully others, mm. what do I do? Mm. Do mm. I go ahead to bully them? Mm. And I'm going to give an example. When I was in GS1, my college mother then. There wasn't water, senior, na senior says three. Your school yes, mother. Yes, my, school no, college mother. mother. They used to give us college mother who sleep on top of the person to take care of you and everything. But na school mother. No, school mm. mother, the ones where go toast you. Uh -huh. okay. This one. No, was, school uh, mother, they toast. Yes, na. Hey. So, college mother, na the one when you come, na school. Okay, na school, that give one. you. So oh. she sleeps under you, you sleep on top. Okay. Because you're just new to the school. So that one go send me, make her go fetch water. I go go, JS1 now, they go chance me, seniors go come with their own college daughters, come fetch water. She, she go go class, go they read, I go they um, boho, they find water, JS1. Sometimes I go cry, come back with empty buckets. Sometimes other seniors go see me, give me small water. I go come give them. Tomorrow I go do rub and shine, go school. She, she go bath, go school. Anyway, I was a junior student that time. So one day, on this faithful day, I came back, there was no water and there was no senior to dash me water to even give her to shower. And she came back from night prep. She said, where is Ezin? I mean, I know say that night go hot. I went to the quadrangle. She came out. Where is Ezin? Ezin, 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 God. I no, 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 no. He did sweet me as in the color of those things. Ah. <laughs> and now, came. Good evening, Sister Arit. Sorry, I'm mentioning her name. So she said, where's Shout my water? Shout out to you. She said, where's my water? I said, I did not get water. Why? You know, lie down for ground. I laid down. Seniors will be passing now. See me. Ah, hostel now, you know. So I think I stood up to go and pee or something. I forgot what happened. She came back. She left me there. She came back. She didn't see me. Isn't it what she Her eyes were red. Isn't it where are you? So as I came, the thing I heard was this resounding slap. Like I saw stars, literally. You were in JSS1. JS1. And I have a, <laughs> a medical history, Sha. As I did now, nobody go feed do anything, reach my ear. Uh, they oh, get small day. ear distance. No, I had it when I was small. I used to have small mm. ear problems. Let me get another ear word. <laughs> so that thing, pulse started coming out of my ear. They carried me to the clinic. In fact, it was a big case. My father came on Monday to the principal's office. They called her to the principal's office, gave my father a cane to flog her. You know, it was a big case because that night I had a family, like a cousin. That was, she was an SS2, but that my cousin was an SS3. So as my cousin saw them taking me to the clinic, my cousin said, eh, isn't it what happened? So she now went with SS3s, now brought her to their hostel. They were beating her. It was somebody that saved her that day. Hmm. Anyway, I survived that. She got her punishment. Fast forward to when I entered SS2. SS3s don't go. We were waiting. They don't write Wayek. Go. We were waiting to enter SS3. They just gave sub prefects, everybody just the head the hot. On a particular day, I would pass. I did very tiny that time. So we commanded some girls. There's the senior. Say, do something. Senior, I want me. The girl his. I turned back. I said, Are you mad? Did you hiss? She not made the comments like that. Backhand. Um. Exactly the way. That's my school mother, my college they mother slapped, slapped me. Mm -hmm. So I take slapped that girl. They called me to the principal's office that day. Principal said, it was a new principal, so she didn't know my history. Mm -hmm. So she said, I'm not dealing with these people, I'm going. So senior body has mistress will take care of you. As I came, it was the same senior body has mistress that handled my case. When you were the victim? When I was the victim. Now you are not the aggressor. As I entered her office, she said, where are the girls? Where are the girls? Who is the bully? Who are the 
She said, you? Mm. <laughs> I started crying. Kai. She said, you? If anybody would tell me in this world that you would do this thing that somebody did for you, that they wanted to kill that girl, mm. that you would ever do it, I would not believe it. Mm. In fact, from that point, mm. eh, I would never bully anybody. Mm. Because mm. at that point, I put myself in that. So it's one mm. thing we do. I'm going to get like that with government. Mm. With government. We are calling, out, we are calling mm. out the government. Mm. How many of us are going to do it right if we were in that position mm. to do it right? Mm. Mm. Another bullying again mm. that a lot of people are not mentioning. Thank God, say you are we are calling up the government. You see, um, we we are talking about yeah. I know our talking topic is about cyber bullying, but bullying generally. Mm -hmm. You know the bullying where they happen for Lagos roads when you they drive. See, eh? they do, eh? let, 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 Hold on, let, let, let me. You're not saying only Lagos, now you go there, your lane, you go there, drive. Before you know, you know, you don't get lane. You know, you don't get lane. Yeah. Oh, oh, Boss driver go bully you, this one go bully you. Insult, I don't insult. Come on, nah, nah. get out. Come on, take out. Now, nah, on, what, on what you spoke about, you see, when you said you got to that point, I went to the body house. So as you were mentioning, Quadrangu, you know, but, but did they sweet me differently because I couldn't see my sister. Now, I, I have been in the boarding house from when I was in primary one. Mm. Uh, oh. You know, I was in primary one, prim I was six when yeah, I was, I was six when I went to the boarding school. Mm. So by the time I got to GSS one, eh, I don't be a bulobo. <laughs> so the seniors that we won't bully myself. Me to add the use Agidi, the you understand? I know because they do like new students. Now, when they will come see me for GS1 class, they will come and say, Ah, this is why now GS1 is there. Now, they follow us the whole ground like this. Now, but fast forward to when I was in X as well. Now, when me, I suppose, come be senior, they're going to come on me for boarding house, bring me come. House. Uh, this is it. Hi. You pay me. See, when me, I suppose, retaliate. When I supposed to be senior, enjoy all my years of suffering, they supposed to pay off. Now, the thing is this. Sometimes, we see an act of revenge mm. Mm, as our time of rejoicing. Mm. And like I said, human beings naturally, we tend to you understand? Notice the bad thing quicker, more quicker than, the good, than the good. And because it's in our nature, if you don't deliberately train yourself, you understand me, to suppress that urge to bully others, you would even be doing it and you will not know. Oh, very true. Very true. You will be doing it and you will not know. And one of the ways to suppress that act in you that I'll tell people today is to value respect. Mm. To value respect. You see, when you value respect, mm, mm. the only thing as I am, I'll be person where if you get angry, but the only thing as I am that can drive me to the point of anger is when I'm disrespected. And why is that? It's because I respect everybody. I try not to look down anybody. You see, the moment you try, some people will take advantage of it, which is some of the things that happen to me because when they see me, Ashley Lord, the other comedians go form. In fact, some comedians, when I see, maybe say, he live for my house, self, where sleep for floor. If I see them, they carry body. How can they lose? Ah, nah, is wow. it that these people don't know where all of us they come from? Awesome. Some of them na act na copy mechanism for yeah. them to avoid some certain interaction. Mm, see finish. You understand? But some people, <sighs> now those people now they respect. You wait there with them, they follow them, they talk. Yeah. You go don't talk some kind of words. You be like one boy where I see yesterday now. You understand? He was excited to see me. It's not that like I gave him my number. The next thing, when he first sent me a message, Daddy, good morning. When I come ask and say, how are you? Uh, say, I hope, I, I hope you're doing well today. He say, yes, bro. Do you understand? Now, the excitement of your humility 
Don't they make and they feel like say mm-hmm. men yeah, are the they, they will be yeah. free. You understand? But mm-hmm. that same person go see a junior colleague way small to me because of the face where that person give him. Ah, baba, baba, baba. Mm-hmm. baba. It is normal. Mm-hmm. You understand? So when you begin to study human behaviors, begin mm-hmm. to understand human behaviors, how, and you how begin to value respect, bullying? how people go take my handle bullying? Like, like I said, um, once you value respect, you understand. And trust me, okay. Let me let me end it with this. Okay. <laughs> Look at this picture. Anybody that wants to bully you, eh, wants to bully you with what you value the most. Mm. First, look at the act of bu- bullying. Just picture them. One of the things they come for, your family, mm-hmm. oh. for your, they come after your work. Oh. Everybody now, if they want to abuse Shea Ilona, wait till they will talk, that dry comedian. It's not even funny. Mm-hmm. It's not even funny. You get one time, one person say, this one that has never even made me laugh a day before. Now I tell and say, if you have ever laughed at my joke, once in your life, may all the good that God has placed ahead of you <laughs> not ever come to you. May you suffer eh, to remember today. No more. Then the person, because me as a be, I'll, I'll lay your foundation of waiting you talk. Now I will take follow you talk. Yeah. The person enter my DM, say, Baba, I beg, reverse no, that course. No, boy, no, Shabby, sir, no, no. Do you understand? I say, you say I never make you laugh before now. Because say you want to abuse me because I follow one politician now. So now I vote for. You want to begin rubbish the career where I don't build for 21 years. Even if you don't value me for anything, you don't value the longevity of uh-huh. the years where I don't put a sacrifice uh-huh. into uh-huh. the business. Uh-huh. Then again, you want to abuse me. For example, you make a caricature of the face of my daughter. Who be the person where they your camp, where you the value? Oh, Peter will be now you the follow. I post a caricature of him too. That one go pain on more. Mm-hmm. Do you understand? So what you don't intend to give, you what you don't intend to take, don't mm-hmm. give it. True, true. That is why I still maintain on the act that give the respect that you want other people to give to, to you. give to you. And when people bully you, you understand me. If you see that your response to this person <laughs> will not, not generate good. the kind of response that you want to. Tolerate. Satisfied. Don't then respond. Don't, don't respond to me. Mm. But sometimes, if it, like I say, sometimes I just look this person. I look say, if I answer this particular one, ah, it go trend small. Mm. People go carry him. Mm. And I know say Linda and KG, they always wait for those kind of response. <laughs> I'll respond to the person. That's why I'll respond to somebody like Bashir Ahmed. We follow Buhari. I didn't vote for Buhari, though he's an APC person. Mm-hmm. I didn't vote for him. I'd never supported him. But the truth is, whether we like it or not, entertainers will not be a good person. The one way they shout, say, Buhari a bad person today. They enjoy tax, uh, this thing, from FRS. They get sponsorship for sure from sure, FRS. Yes. But today, all of them, all of them are the abuse Buhari person. They are followers. When they follow them, they abuse Buhari for, no, no, say they get money. They only Buhari regime. You see the way human being they. And some of our senior colleagues, you know, say they don't they collect the money from FRS. They no talk until the day where I know about them. I may begin open the eyes of junior colleagues to those things. Those junior colleagues where I open their eyes to those things, none of them talk about them today. Say when at one point the government was supporting entertainment, now she will open our eye. Mm. They no talk. But the people then we collect, where they know introduce them to that thing today, then they sing. Yeah, praise. You understand? That is human being for you. And again, you me? Nigerians, we like to hide other something that, oh, we are just joking. It's just for fun. We are chasing screws. Yeah. But again, we also do have people around us. Like now, you, you might know somebody that might be a popular blogger that can instigate or start a particular rumor and that will affect the person they are starting the rumor about. Like, how do we, as a society, how do we caution ourselves? Even because oh, maybe that your friend is a popular blogger, has so, so, so million followers, and he's helping your own career yes. too. You know, if you open your yes. mouth to correct the person, that, that, we that's know what, that's deep why. down, we know deep down it is wrong. Don't. So we can't be sitting here right now and be saying, oh, bullying is not, when we know that we're still going to go and laugh under that person's post that is bullying someone else. How do we... That's, that's, that's why I have an issue with Tunde Ednot. I, I didn't mention him. No, 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 no. You know why? You know why I mentioned Tunde Ednot? Tunde yeah. Ednot was somebody at one time who felt basketball bullied him at the co-hotel. 
And one day I put the comment on his page. Hey, remember the day where Basket slapped you for a coattail? Well, you be like, say, go do... Basket Mad was the MC at an event or something. I can't really remember the full story. Now, you felt bullying that day. I saw the way you did cry. Ah, baba, this one. But today, now you the champion the cause of the bullying of other people. Like you said, when you are the one who is in the position to bully, mm -hmm. it is sweet to you. Mm -hmm. Because now you have a lot of people who are speaking for you. This Alex Wobi, we will start this discussion. Now today I'm not starting now. Mm. You don't forget, so when I finish the match, now I make the post. Today now I don't run delete them. You don't run delete them. I know they delete posts where I post. You know why? Because I always have a thought process. You understand? I think it through before I make any post. Any post where you don't see for my page, I probably have a reason to archive it. Mm -hmm. So that tomorrow, if you want to talk, I go bring a comment. I say, I archive it. Not because I wanted to delete it, because I know they delete posts. I archive it so that the day when it reach time to talk, I'll bring a comma side. Like no buigwe, I'll bring the post comma side where I first post. We start a discussion between me and no buigwe. You cannot wake up one morning, come and talk on social media, say this person was a, the worst governor that has ever done this one, was this one. Then today you say the person I be Messiah. Okay, I want to agree with you that the person is the Messiah. Are you willing to come out publicly? To say that post that I made that time, I made it from the place of ignorance. Or I made that post that time because I just hated this person. If you can convince me like that, then I will know that you're a man of your word. But if you cannot do it, then you are not a truthful person. Mm -hmm. Do you understand me? Mm -hmm. Now, a Tunde had not, for example, you've been in this entertainment business. You saw what people suffer to build a name for themselves. You shouldn't be the one that should be the scene in a place where those names have been rubbish. No, not be you, supposed be the person. We go there in that position. We go see person, we don't walk. Ah. So they know they do bad days. People, they buy things. I don't get money to buy cow for them. At least I still remember. I know if he talks, he won't send my money back to me. I sent him 100K. Say, maybe they buy something too. Not because, why, is, why am I saying it? Because all this bullying of Sheyi Law during the election started from his page. Mm. It started from his page. He go post some things, I'll just put laugh. The thing the verse, Sam. <laughs> I ain't go post one of the video where I don't, I don't even do the video, where I don't even relate to the topic of waiting in talk before. He can't go bring the video, can't post them for a page like saying, I'm waiting in talk. Now he make me do that video. People can't start to they abuse me from there. You they see him, and you were you are enjoying it. Because at that time, once you post anything where they against Tinobu, and you forget, say you two, you get father. <laughs> Even if you don't get father, one day you will become a father. If they abuse you as a father, do they understand me? And your children get to see it tomorrow. Do you think they will be happy? But you, they coordinate attack on another man's father. And you, they enjoy and the glory in the denigration of another man. Mm. <laughs> My brother, we feel say Kama no day again. Maybe Kama go on holiday. Mm -hmm. But one day, the path that an old man has walked, if we live long, if we live long enough, we will walk on that same path. Facts. And we will look back and maybe the story we will tell will be different. Come on now, before, before... Oh, no, 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 verse, may I, round up, may I round up with this word? One time, Elijah walked past a path mm. with Elisha. With, uh, Elisha walked down a path with, with Elijah. Elijah. Yes. And people were laughing at Elisha. Mm. But when, you don't understand, when Elisha was coming back, he came back with a different anointing. Yes. And you know what happened? Lions yes. came out and devoured. As they laugh at me again, he Lion came them. out and devoured those people. I hope that Tunde Ednon, when you become a father tomorrow and people laugh at you, you will not call heaven and earth 
to fall on them because you've enjoyed the laughter and the bullying of another person. Um, so, Baba, the, this 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 episode has been humbling, very humbling. And now because of say, the truth is, you cannot hide under ignorance. Mm. You cannot hide under ignorance. No excuse. Waiting, you know, waiting, you waiting, you not know, you not know. But he not mean say that in day wrong. Mm. Like I am a product of the public school system in Nigeria, and like the example that Ezine shared. You know, some of it is we endured as junior students. We endured them because we think, say, nah, normal process, nah, like maybe a right of initiation. So when we become seniors, you remember how they used to flog us, we'll flog you too. So I think that as a society, some of these things need to be dismantled. Mm -hmm. Then as a people too, we need to unlearn a lot of the things that we have learned. Mm -hmm. We need to unlearn a lot of these things the and begin to teach people. Mm -hmm. We, when we know, go to teach those we no know. Like, for example, I get friends when be little people. Eh? Although they're not common for society, you know, people when you there, they see every day. So sometimes when you see this kind of people, it is they strange, or when you see somebody who is an albino, it is they strange. So what you must do is to begin to teach those who are younger than you are that these people are, you know, human beings like us, of great value and importance that add value too to society. So all those times when we smoke, we go copy say ah, rah, rah. Uh, or mm. all those kind of things. Mm. Now, because of say we don't know, but as we don't grow up now, the onus is on us to teach those who are younger than us quickly mm. so that they would know about this. Mm -hmm. the, the failure of our generation is the decadence of the next generation that mm. we are seeing. And I'll tell you the honest truth, eh? whether you like it or not. See, when we they grow up, our uncles them, they they strict on us. Yeah. They go do some certain things. And when they reach our own time, we come to say, ah, Maybe because we've come to a place of realization, we say, ah, no, I don't want to do this thing the way they do us. No, mm -hmm. no, do unto these children. You understand? But then we can't give them liberty mm, without containment. Mm -hmm. And I wear some families, they get them wrong. Mm -hmm. And I be the decadence what they see on social media. So mm -hmm. in my own family, what I try to do, I tell my nephews and nieces, cousins and other stuff, I tell them, freedom is sweet but it's very expensive. Any man that refuses to subject himself to authority hmm, will live a life that he will start begging authority to come to his rescue. Mm. Mm. And now, the reason I say that is this. So I tell my girl, I say, see, you see, see as you come now, you they go back to school, I give you 50K. When we they go that time, nobody give us a... Mm -hmm. But I give you this 50K, not be because, say... I won't make you misbehave. Oh. Because I know, say, this 50K, even this 50K, if you don't even reach you. Mm -hmm. But no look, say, you go there, you go live lavishly to say, I get one shayi You go give me back. Because you go come again. If I ask you, you can't give accounts. You understand me? You know, see, see, see. So, because I don't already talk those things, it go make them go back, behave. Yes. Or sometimes my... One of my nephews will come. I'll pack clothes, give him. I'll just say, ah, maybe I'll go into a room and see the clothes. I say, ah, ah. Eh? See these jeans, what I give you now? You Say, you know, say these jeans now, 45,000. You know, say these jeans, you know, say now Zara jeans. Even me, as at the time when I start comedy, you know, say the atmosphere they wear Primark. Mm -hmm. You know, say it took me a gradual process to graduate to wear Zara. So I can't give you that. I see the way you ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> now you don't pack that. They don't dirty. They smell it. ah. Uh -huh. For your present, another of your friend will come. I go enter my wardrobe. I go pack those clothes where you like. Mm. Where you don't know, tell me say bros. I like. I will pack and give the friend. Mm. Then when you your friend come where and come that day, I'll come call you. You see the way you wear the cloth. You see the way you value them. Oh. No worry, now nah, I go to give my cloth. Mm. What we make, what do the, what the person do? Yeah, do we sit up and start treating those yeah, clothes nicely? Mm. Mm -hmm. That is how we train people. Mm. Yes. But our generation, with the look, say, let them grow on their own. I think I people think... who grow on their own, <laughs> eh, <laughs> we become the disturbances that you are trying to avoid in your life. It's just the, the decadence, she used to say the decadence of our. Something the failure is, of is our it, generation. the failure of our generation in decadence of the this next generation. generation. It, 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 in my own understanding, the bad eggs of when would they grow up? They don't born children now. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
they don't want children now. And you, when it be say, people like me and you, where they use iron hand trainers, mm-hmm. they are we can't do anyhow. You they think now, say your own children where you don't born. Oh, make her no use that on your hand, train them, mama, no flog them. Now those things he join waiting follow take no, mold. T- 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 if you hear him, you he he just waiting so. take mold because for UK they say you know if you flog children, I they tell them if they misbehave, reach the one where we say you need to flog. Come on, their socks flog under the leg where the socks back. The mark no go show. Uh. Mm, the mark no go show. <laughs> I'm not saying flog your children. No. Yes. I'm just saying. Yes. You understand? For those we like to put a little. You understand? Because we have, whether we like it or not, they do, we cannot things. fail to we train cannot. the children where they come from. They can train you where. You know, go go social media, go to call somebody idiot. See your stupid head. <laughs> they don't train you where for house. <laughs> oh, ni wani. They do not rest. There is a woman, uh, there is a family I met in the UK. Let me even give them shout out. Prince and Princess of Shinloye. Eh? Prince and Princess Shola of Shinloye. This family, as at the time I met them in 2010, you understand me? I go to their house. 2012, I went to their house. Their children kneel down, greet me for UK. I say, yeah? Mm. You get children where they train well for this UK? Mm. Do you understand? I looked at this family. I've been friends with them since 2012. And I said, this is the model that I want my children to follow. And when my wife said she wanted to go to the UK, <laughs> I said, you see this woman? I beg, learn her way. Now, so I want more to train our children too. So one time, a doctor that got married in December, December 29, I was the MC at the monarch here. Now, the woman said, different people come, they, come, they want to make their children marry. <laughs> say she just, say some people come, say she just laughs. Say, me, why I take my time? Because say, with the UK, me, why I take my time, train my children well. You can't bring your picking where you know train well to come marry my daughter. I know go walk. Oh. Mm-hmm. The woman no agree. Mm-hmm. But if you see the boy where the, the, the daughter marry now, the man, the young man where the daughter marry, oh you understand? Daddy. And you see the, oh my Lord, ah! <laughs> you know what I said? I said, God, help me to train my children the way this woman trained her children in a foreign land mm. where they understand culture, where they understand the act of respect, where they understand what discipline is. And I tell myself too, say any man will go just wake up one day saying they come for my daughter hand in marriage. Uh, you too, they must train you well. Mm. Because I don't want a situation where I go train my own well. Then one untrained boy Go come, you know, go walk. And when that untrained boy come, you go affect the seeds. Where go come, go come from, from you? Mm-hmm. Now we they see so now all those auntie where misbehave for area, they're born, leave the children anyhow. Those children now, they don't born their own. You know they see say, some area where you for grow. You go there now. You they see something that they they ah. Who born this one? They say now, I'm going to ah. I'm going to see born for this area. <laughs> Do you understand? <laughs> you say, Mama, ah, they say now, I'm going to ah. I'm a, oh, yeah. And the funny part also, I say, Hey, it, like I said, I was I was talking talking earlier. Give don't tell me say thank God say I talk. I'm, I don't have the statistics, but I believe that eighty percent of those. Ah, if you know get statistics, no problem. I, 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 I am saying it. Let me say what I want to say. I'm saying it from my emotions and from the things that I see. Oh. I believe that eighty percent of the people that use and talk on social media are not smart enough. Emotionally smart and otherwise, emotionally intelligent and otherwise, they are not because you're quick, you're quick to react to something without even doing due diligence to understanding what that thing is. See, every time where them post about oh dollar has appreciated over a naira, it is now so this. Some people go think say na, naira don't don't get part. See when them put for subsidy. People for comment, 80% don't know what is subsidy be. Yeah. I'm like, I know not the comments pass. So you don't it, see one comment that wait to say that they talk of first subsidy removal. I agree with the say, I want to take bow CG. I want bow CG. I want bow CG. I want bow CG. Come on. So, those that don't think I've said this episode, go there very humbling. And now all of us, this matter concerned, and in the little way we can, we can make impact and begin to change this, our society. Mm-hmm. No gain to say, because you, now you want savage pass, or now you'll be the first person to always drag people. You know, make any sense. Let's act accordingly. Let's try as much as we can to, you know, be that positive light in the lives of other people. And small, small, even though it's the 
Light no day like that. This is the last week of Are you sure? You don't be, be positive the, to everybody. You don't drink. No, don't, don't, don't be the one to drive another man mm. into depression yes. and then be the one to cry loudest. Mm. And, and and don't be the one to support a negative thing about somebody. Me, mm. hey, my block are here. Me, smart heart, the block. I don't talk about before. If you talk something bad about me in any of my comments, the, the, the good thing is that they're not they come my comments. Or I go anywhere, you talk something bad. Now, anybody way first like the comments, if not 200 people like the comment, my coco block everybody to like comments here. Then I'll now come to you, wait to write talk the thing. My block a year. My blocking list, he plenty pass plenty celebrities followers. Mm-hmm. Interesting. I, I, I lost over I lost over 200,000 followers because of the election, which for me is not a problem. The most important thing is that whatever you do, try as much as possible to do know that you're doing it from the right place. Whatever you do, are you sure you're doing it from the right place? Mm. Is it fair to those concerned? If you are not being fair, don't do it. Okay, okay so uh, a <laughs> very important question before we just, uh, you know, wrap. You know, given all that you have had to endure or deal with, do you think that politi- uh, do you think that celebrities should be active participants or be involved actively in politics? You see, the truth is this, eh? and we must understand it. Politics determines whatever goes on around our life. And if you refuse to be a part of it, you might be at the losing end. Mm. Mm. Even those who are part of it still lose. Not to talk of you that refuse to be a part of it. Some of these so-called celebrities, ways of people, they say, now they talk truth fast. (laughs) They are actually beneficiaries of the rot. In the mm. system, and which is why I am confident and boldly I say it that any politician, whether dead or alive in Nigeria, cannot come and point to me, Oluwa Sheiton Lawrence, Idili Oyalatile, mm. that I gave Sheila money to support me, or I gave Sheila one cobble to influence his decision. I don't do it because whatever I do, I look at the posterity for my children, and I can speak boldly to anybody. That's why even if I had supported Tinobu today, mm. I can look at his face tomorrow and say, Baba, you know they do well. Mm. When I when I when I am supposed to speak. The reason why probably some people will say I'm not talking right now is because I'm giving them time. They talked about some CNG buses that they were supposed to roll out, some palliative that they should open the national food storage and bring out food and all the stuff. I'm waiting. It go get where it go reach. If we don't see, you know, these things, implementation of these things working well, then we should be able to speak and speak out for the people. But that celebrities should not be involved in politics is not something that we should say. Mm. Politics determines our life. Mm-hmm. True. Tinumbu probably gave Lagos, a, made Lagos a conducive environment for, all for entertainment to, to strive, thrive. to thrive today. Yes. And I can say it. Some people will tell me, oh, you supported, you know. See, this place that we are today, that we are recording, is on the island today. Some 25 years ago, they no born you and me well. Today, this place. But I remember the first time I came to perform comedy around this vicinity. Gordon's did a show here over 15 years ago. When I come, come to perform that the night, they come on light. They took the light. Now me hold the microphone, they perform inside darkness. They make people laugh inside darkness. You understand? As at that time, I know sure said if you sell land for this place, reach 100,000. I know sure. I know sure say anybody want buy them. But the value of progress, and they increase the value of a place. Yes. But today, for this same place, you know if you see land less than five, 50 million naira. Mm. For this same place. Somebody brought some certain level of progress. We don't open the place up. And the reason why I know it was because my secondary school was on the island, Methodist Boys High School. My senior secondary school was on the island. And I remember 1998, before we transitioned to democracy, Redeem Church did a program in Lekki. They call it Lekki 98. It was at the Lekki Beach. And I remember coming to attend that program. When we finished that program, we were trekking home because there was traffic and there were no buses. And we were trekking home. The place that they call Osakwa London today mm, mm. was swamp. I remember some women were selling fishes at the place where filling station day today. 
You understand me? All those places, if you enter the swamp, water will go swallow your leg, go reach, go go above your knee. Mm. And they catch crocodile for the, the place where they call Osaka London today. But somebody came, became the government of Lagos. I remember the place where they call Oriental Hotel today, where Oriental Hotel there today, it was a dump site. Now they have a bus stop, the Morocco Sanfit bus stop, it's the opposite that Oriental. When we stop for that place, you mm. understand? Now, every other week, when we come back, when we don't go weekend, we'll come back, we'll hear say they don't see one dead body for the yeah. dump site where they're there. But somebody concessioned that place to a company and they built Oriental Hotel. And look at the beauty that we are seeing in that area. Those are the things that measure up to progress, where some of us see. I remember one time in Lagos, they go write letter to houses, say six o'clock, they come rob I'm rubber, yeah. They're not born on a well. Six o'clock, they go come. Mm. They get that confidence. But somebody partnered with the police and they came up with RRS. You understand me? And when they, because there was an operation sweep that followed the military and, and the left, then RRS came with the police. You understand? And then they started buying almond vehicle and positioning them as strategic location within Lagos, those hotspots. And that sense of give, that kind of gave us the sense of security. Now, some of the things where we will see. That time, what was nice nightlife? That time with a dodge come up for us. Now, when you don't finish secondary school, you know the way we do it. You dodge come up for us, but somebody brought a sense of security. Maybe say, we call it do events before who born comedy show to end for the following morning? Who born comedy show to end for midnight? Who they even they do comedy show? The first comedy show was done by TA 2005. Yeah. Yes. You remember? Live, yeah. and, Live and, naked. and Naked. Live and Naked. And then the second edition, when TA did the second edition of Life and Naked, was in 2007. You understand me? When TA did 2007, I remember that 2007. I did have more people who arranged chair finish. When we arranged the chair finish, when it was time to start the show, they say, more will go outside. They go check everybody in. They don't allow me to enter the show till the show finish. At the front of Busan I sit down there, I cry till the show finish. <laughs> but you know what? It is part of the story. You understand me? I couldn't have seen all these things. And then you want to convince me otherwise that I don't know the man that I'm voting for. Mm. He's, has he made some mistake now? I am still waiting. There are certain things that I'm not happy with. I know that we're floating the Naira, but then give people some certain palliative that we ease the pressure of this thing on them. Instead of fuel subsidy, I would prefer transportation subsidy. Instead of, you know, dollar subsidy, I would prefer food and manufacturing subsidy. These are the things that I will ask for. Not that fuel subsidy is young. Person will not even know the color of dollar self. Could they shout dollar at him one? <laughs> Mama, I love you now. And another thing, all <laughs> these things you said, all, uh, all these things that you said in rapping, um, um, as as she is saying it, most of you have been saying, hey, hey, hey. no, don't use your emotions to to rationalize what he's mm. saying. Use fact to rationalize it. And before you judge anything, listen to understand before you not to give react. your not to react. Not, don't listen to reply. A round of applause for Shilo. Baba, you too much. Thank you. Thank you. Finally.